Okay, we left off um, at the start of Jack's loyalty mission. Yep, this is the last loyalty mission we have to do before we move on to the new dossiers. Is Steam drank for anyone else? Is it a Tuesday? It is, isn't it? Yeah, Steam does maintenance on Tuesday, Tuesday evening, so it should be unjanked in a few minutes. You gotta like sew it through the skin, not like stabbing yourself. Oh God, it doesn't hurt. You can't, you can't do that with a needle, safety pin, etc. You don't feel it at all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Kels with another VIP gamble yeah, going with 13. Good luck, Kels. 237. Oh no, we're getting further away. Unlucky. I'm so sorry. So sorry. Sleeping Beauty again. You used to love covering your hands with Elmer's. Yes. No, a lot of people did that, Dan. Yeah, putting like Elmer's glue on your hand and then peeling it off. Yep. <laughs> All these childhood memories being unlocked right now. My goodness. Chaos Tuesday. And I'm campus for you, great job, Jack. <laughs> All right, let's see. What are we doing here? Uh, Jack subject. I got. I gotta speed run this game if we're gonna beat it in time for Dragon's Dogma Two. All right, we're here. All it said was travel here, and now I think Jack's plan is just to biotically blow blow this poop hole. We're it's gonna blow it. And plant the bomb in myself. Yep. I wanna yep. watch this place burn. See, what did I tell you? <laughs> plant the bomb, watch it burn. Yep. I'm ready to shoot something. Okay, this place is overgrown with plants. I'm getting like Resident Evil vibes for some reason. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They were messed up and starving, but alive. Usually. This is... I brought my love Garrus with us. I love Garrus! Okay, starting out with a quick hack. Nice. Tomato. Oh my god, tomato pin cushion. You know what I find really strange? Is that so many families, apparently, use... Uh, I don't know if any of your families did this, but my family did this, where we had that, like, tin, that blue tin of cookies, but, like, there weren't cookies in there. It was, like, sewing materials and the tomato pin cushion. <laughs> That's what was in the blue cookie tin container and i thought that was just my family but apparently like a whole bunch of other families did the same thing and i'm like why how the same container of cookies like where do you even get those cookies from i've never seen those cookies in the supermarket but somehow all these families had that same container and all these families used the same container to store all their sewing materials what <laughs> so strange I love Garrus. They also used to make needle darts with paper and pieces of eraser. No, that sounds very dangerous. Your childhood memory unlocked recently was making uh, running a Gatorade powder ring that you would sell to your classmates for a dollar. I just gave all of my friends in school free gum and I should have been charging them. What was I thinking? I was the gum person. The blue tin of butter cookies project, yes. Yes, hi harmless, yes. I'm so glad that you guys know what I'm talking about, okay? You had the sewing kit and a butt ton of buttons, yes. The sugar cookie skin. I remember eating all those cookies, but I don't know why we saved the tin to be like the thing that holds the sewing Sewing, the sewing stuff, right? The butter cookies. Yeah, hi, Cal. Good to see you. Hello, hello. The blue cookie tin is 100% just a pre sewing kit. But why? <laughs> but why? The heckin' sewing kit. I don't understand why. Same can confirm. See, everyone's family had the same thing. I don't understand it. You've had the cookies, we buy them all the time. Yeah, my family always has those cookies, and I don't know where they get them from, because I swear I've never seen them in the supermarket. Butter cookies, yeah, kind of like shortbread cookies, right? The sewing kit is why I have unresolved trust issues. <laughs> one for sewing materials and one for crayons in your family. I love it. You add the tin just to try and scotch your childhood trauma of the blue cookie tin being filled with needles. <laughs> your grandma used to buy us those circle tin uh, uh, butter cookies. Yeah, yes, yes, those ones. Yep, I don't even have to click on it. I know exactly what it looks like. The cookie tin of lies. Whose idea was that? Like, who was the first person to be like, 
This would make a great container for sewing things. <laughs> and threw the thing out so they would never hurt you again, Project. You poor thing. I don't think there's gonna be people here. There's just a lot of plants growing in here. Security console. The elusive man requested operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. When we get results, he won't care what we did. But if he knew, he won't find out. The elusive man requested operation logs. What? Again. They're talking suspicious. about the elusive man. When we come you stuck one in the ceiling, was afraid to knock it down. So your sister did it for you, and it stuck in her foot. Ow! She's being the, the source of chewing gum. Makes sense. <laughs> Uh, Madeira unlocked your childhood memory of your stepmother and sister, took it upon themselves to melt our crayon remnants together into new crayons, and they used cookie cutters as molds. They fed one to toddler me, assuring you it was actually a cookie? Oh my god, sweet, that's awful. I can't believe they actually, like, tried to feed you one. Am I more of an Oreo or Chips Ahoy girl? I think you asked me this, same Dreamer, and I said I prefer chocolate chip cookies. But between those two, honestly, I eat Oreos more often. Yeah, but I like homemade chocolate chip cookies uh, the most. The cookies are at both of your local stores. You're looking at them longingly a couple of days ago. I'll shop and get one. This is your sign to get one waffle. He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. All right, something about the elusive man here. I think I think this is coming into play because Jack's backstory is kind of that she was grown in like Cerberus labs and the elusive man is kind of like I don't know sort of the head of Cerberus right so I guess it would make sense that he's being brought up here Jack loyalty mission fine yeah she's the only one we have left um, of the I guess the first set of dossiers and then we're gonna move on to the new dossiers I guess you need a strong container so that needles don't poke through oh maybe that's why yeah Oreo is the only correct answer. I like Chips Ahoy too, though. I will hear nothing but Oreo. Wow. Hydrox gang? Doodad with a VIP gamble going Oreos, Oreos, Oreos seven times. <laughs> Good luck, Doodad. Seven. 335. Doodad, that was so close, but unlucky. <laughs> You like making cookies? I love baking cookies too. Not grown specifically, but prodded and pricked at. Oof. She was kidnapped as a baby, but grown is way funnier. Okay, <laughs> I don't know. Well, Miranda kind of made it seem like she was lab grown too, right? Her and her twin, because they have the same DNA, but they're not actual twins, right? The, the other girl, her twin is way younger than her. So I don't know. I don't understand how Cerberus works or exactly what they're doing. Cookies of any variety is okay with me and coffee. I love coffee and cookies. I remember Almost. escaping to this room, fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. Okay. Where's the enemies? I want to shoot him. This place is kind of creepy. Okay. The actual close streak has ended. It never ends. It's always close. <laughs> it was fun while it lasted. For a second there, it got lots of really close hits, you know. Okay, also it's very dark in here. Um, maybe I should go up these stairs first. I don't know. I can't decide. No, I think this bottom part's a dead end. <gasps> oh! Enemies on our right! Okay. Uh, what are we working? Oh, heavy shockwave might be good. Concussive blast, absolutely incinerate. Wow, we are yeah. so strong! Oh, that one's still alive. Whoa, that was pretty poggies, actually. <laughs> Very neat. Old blood stain. Uh oh. This looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here, pit me against other kids. Oh no! I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. Reason for fights? What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood anything that happened here. How often did they do this? I was in a cell my whole life, 
Sometimes they took me out and made me fight. Filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did other children die in these fights? I was a kid, filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. Narcotics flooded my veins when I attacked. So that's a yes? <laughs> they condition you to fight? That's sick! What the hell was wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. Let's keep moving. Hey. Hell yes. I should have gone upstairs first, so we're gonna backtrack. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> Always copium. <laughs> oh, I can't go upstairs. I thought for sure that was a ramp upstairs. Never mind. Okay, back we go. Dude, the fully, um, when you like fully upgrade a skill, it becomes really strong. Really, really strong. Like that shockwave was upgraded and so was the concussive blast. Both really strong. I think my incinerate too. Security Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the- That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Maybe there was more to it. Let's keep moving or not. Things might have happened that you didn't see. The other kids attacked me. The guards attacked me. The automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. Yikes. Okay. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that Baron? It's a uh oh, fresh someone's here with us. Yikes. You want to redeem a VIP gamble, but you can't? Um, there is a cooldown on it, St. Dreamer. So that means someone probably redeemed it really recently. Um, so you just got to time it properly. Yeah. Uh, human redeeming one for Anne Rose. So nice, human. Anne Rose, if you have a number ready, friend, let me know. You're so back. Let's go. Oh, 99 again. Okay. 99 again. Good luck. 360 do. So close. So close, but unlucky. Yep. Still very close, guys. <laughs> anyone, still anyone's gamba. All right. Someone is here. Someone just killed these doggos, and it was not us. Someone is definitely in here. Oh, wait. No, let me open this door first. This is me when I play a game, okay? I'm just like very indecisive about which ways I want to go. I'm sorry. Okay. <gasps> Element zero, we need that. Very nice. All right, who's here? I know you're here. I have a gun. They've seen us. <gasps> oh, they seen us. Nice. Oh, it's a Krogan. Hit him with the fire. Oh, what is this? Come here. Oh, he's flying. Oh, they're all flying. <laughs> Why are they all flying? <laughs> okay. Oh no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch the landing. <clears throat> Yikes. Lots of people here. Why'd they need a morgue? This was a small facility. I'm saying some sick son of a bitch killed a lot of kids with these experiments. And some sick son of a biscuit. Company. Bullshit. I had the worst of it and I made it out alive. Uh. Why is not working this fast today? <clears throat> that was your second guess. <laughs> Good 
good tries. Oh, have I been there? Maybe. Oh, maybe we opened that from the other way. Wayne the Great won Gretzky's number, right, Anne Rose? Uh huh. <laughs> Oh, Fix got the zoomies. Hi, bud. <laughs> Sorry if it's noisy. Uh, scratch one. Sorry. What's 99 bits from new badge? Dan, thank you for the 100 bits. I really appreciate it. Enjoy your new badge, friend. Thank you so much. You love Doggo Zumi. He is Zoom in. <laughs> so strange to be back here. I feel like I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch, but then I'm a little girl again. <laughs> Still going. It's complicated. Let's just go plant that bomb. No, he's not Mr. Hamburger. He's a ball. He's a ball this time. You love Doggo Zumis. We love a Zoomy boy. Doggo Zoomies are a gift from the Choosy Cult Lords that we don't deserve. All this 99, is there a prophecy I'm missing? Are you gonna go? <laughs> Woo! 25k bits badge! My goodness, Stan! That's a lot of bits! Thank you so much! Thank you for the hydrate, Virgil! Thank you, thank you! Everyone hydrate! <laughs> Did you hear that? He just sneezed! Oh my goodness, Fig's a mess today. Alright. Oh, you and Chum are twins! You are adorable! It's about to get- Uh-oh! Yikes, 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 back it up! Jeez, they just popped out of nowhere! Okay, now I'm scared. Oh, no, 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 no! That's a dog, that's a dog! Scoped and scoped and drop! Never saw me coming! What? Who said that? That didn't sound like Garrus or Jack. Who said that? <laughs> I guess these are the little rooms that they put the kids in. Because there's bunk beds in there. They kept children here. Did y'all ever sleep on a bunk bed? Specifically the top bunk? <laughs> All right, looks like we gotta go this way. Hi, J-Man, how are you doing? Good to see you. You still remember the Gwent bit wars of 23? <laughs> I am Dan, Dan is me. You lost so many bits in the Gwent wars. <laughs> Popped and scoped and dropped. That was a Garrus line? That didn't even sound like him. That sounded nothing like Garrus. Giving in to the blood loss, I love him. Love him even more. Thought you were the bottom bunker? I've been both, I've been both, but the top bunk is scary. <laughs> Once you did you fell off of it one time. No way. How did you fall off? Top bunk was best I rolled a lot in my sleep when I was little and I fallen off like a normal height bed before The bunk bed the top bunk had like guardrail so you couldn't fall off but still still scary Because <laughs> I rolled off a bed before uh, Bunk beds were the best you were the top bunker when you say to your cousins 10 out of 10 would fall off again <laughs> When you were little, you thought you uh, you thought that bunk beds meant someone was rich. That's hilarious, Kels. At camp, D did you all go to like summer camp? I've never been to a summer camp, but I always wonder what it was like. Never bet against Northern Realms. <laughs> never. No, actually, twice. All right, Saint Dreamer with the VIP gamble. There you go. Going with two fifty. Good luck. Six forty six. So close, but unlucky. You had a loft bed when you were a teenager and your cat learned how to climb the ladder. That's so cool. You've been on the top bunk, you fell off too. Oh no. How did y'all fall off the bunk? 
you move a lot in your sleep still so that's how oh no cal yeah it's like when you hit the floor and you wake up and you're just like what <laughs> what was i doing i've done a lot of weird things in my sleep top bunk always god reels on bunk beds are for rich people <laughs> We had like a metal frame bunk bed. That's all I really remember about it. Uh, and it had guardrails. I think it had guardrails on one side. So we had pushed the side that didn't have guardrails like against the wall so you couldn't roll off of it. Your two little brothers did bunk beds for a while, but you're glad you weren't involved. One of them may have done some wedding and no one likes taking a shower in the middle of the Oh God, no. Your brother knew you had bunk bed, but it dev had a rail on the side, so you can't fall off. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> if you didn't have a rail, I was asking for trouble. You went to summer camp when you were a senior in high school. It wasn't much of a vacation. The summer camp was only four miles from my house. You did go to camp every year. Very fun. Nice. You went to day camp. Bust in and out each day. Wow. True story. Me, four years old, and my sister, six years old, decided to pillow fight on the top bunk. <gasps> she knocked me off and I broke my leg. Oh my God, Joe. That's actually insane. Oh my goodness. Hopefully your leg's okay. I feel like if you, if you break something, maybe better when you're younger, because then maybe your body has more time to heal. I don't know. I don't know how it works, but man. Oh my God. I bet that hurts so bad. Summer camp was fun, except we had to camp outside one night during the week and had to poop in a hole in the ground. Yeah, I don't know if I could do that. <laughs> I love that you say so close. Hi, yes, no, maybe sure. So it is so close. <laughs> you used to move a lot in your sleep. You're a lot better compared to back then. Yeah, I'm the same way, Mr. Anthony. When I was younger, I moved so much in my sleep. Nowadays, I think I'm better. I haven't rolled off the bed recently. Yeah. You just remember your childhood bed was like a mini playhouse. It had a ladder and a slide. You used to hide everything under it and say, I cleaned my room. <laughs> adorable bottle bunk is good too because you could just kick your sibling if they were snoring exactly so funny i love that we have so many like shared childhood memories it's great this it's a two-way mirror my cell is on the other side i could see all the other kids out here i screamed at them for hours and they always ignored me uh-oh Just having a little therapy session with Jack, it's fine. I must have come through here when I broke out. Ooh, what is this? But I don't remember it. This is a bad place. Yeah. Creepy. I don't like this. Security console. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects, but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. I do not like that image. This is bullshit. They weren't doing all that crazy stuff for my safety. Uh, they're experimenting on the other children for my safety. Don't blame yourself. Makes sense. This whole place was built to turn you into what you are. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. Find strength in it. Move on. Harder and tougher. Oh. Okay. Got power cells. Another security console. It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. Uh oh. We're shutting Telton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully, that will give. Who oh, what? Zero, wait! Shepard, oh. they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. You were distracted. You were a kid. You couldn't have known. Maybe. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Oh boy.
No! Oh, camping was great as a kid, except the one this. time I s slid off a log, got my sneakers wet. Parents made me wear them all day when we walk for miles. You were complaining your feet hurt so bad and your parents were like, suck it up. But when I got home, some time to sit down and take my sneakers off, my skin was falling off. Oh my God, sweet. I'm so sorry. That sounds awful. Yeah, like having, keeping your feet wet uh, for too long with like socks on, I think is really bad, right? Jeez, that sounds awful. Found a few weeks ago that babies are born without kneecaps. Human babies, am I right? Dead from the four miles from home camp. Sweet Laura, sweet had a questionable youth. Yep, yep, <laughs> very true. Mama said stupid is stupid does. Everyone Google trench, yes, trench foot, exactly. Uh-oh. Hey, Arash, it's Kira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. Oh boy. You promised us lots of salvage. But this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put him down. But I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. Why are you here? Get ready to fight. Do not Google that. <laughs> I will not be doing Someone who's brave and is willing to take a bullet for the team, Google trench foot and give a do us an educate, but like a PG version of it. <laughs> if I Google trench foot, then I puke. You're in my way. You're in my way. Oh god, there's so many Krogan. Alright, take out the easy targets first. Oh, they're floating again. Oh my god, Jack's going in. Wow, they're hiding a lot. It's kind of hard to hit them. Look at look at this guy peeking. Oh, this one's running. Oh no. And stay down. Garrus, get this one. Garrus. I love this one. I'll kill them myself. We got one left. The peek. Oh my god, he's coming too. He's on the move. Uh oh. Fly, bitch. <laughs> Guys. Got him, it's fine. Only room left is my old cell. Whoever Aresh is, he's in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. All right, I gotta, I gotta stock up on ammo before we do this. Hold on. Oh God. Phew. You'll have to throw away your computer again. <laughs> Guess nobody cares that Sui's foot fell off. Very insensitive chatters tonight. Shaking my head, my head. <laughs> I don't blame you if you don't want to Google trench fit, okay? Because I don't either. But if you're curious, you know, might as well educate the rest of us. <laughs> this part was fixed because they all ran for you and it was, it was too much and you died a lot. I'm glad they didn't do that, yeah. It reminds me of like the duo in Triple Crystallians and Elden Ring. Uh, who are all aggroed on you immediately. Now they like take turns being aggro. Come out. We know you're here. Uh oh. Who are you? My name is Oresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. This guy seems so many years innocent. Passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. He was drawn here like you. Why are you here? Come on, Chum, take one for the team. No. Just play Vanguard can't run at you if you run at them first. 
Mine is Joel and Ellie looking at giraffes. Oh, that's your desktop wallpaper. I love that. You choose Kel's background. Hearing the word trench foot is enough for me to want to not want to finish my dinner. Remember the Last of Us episode with Bill soul crushing? I cried so much in that Why episode. Did you come back? I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew. How to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting uh -oh. the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. Okay, he's not innocent anymore. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? Arash, you'd start it again? How did you escape, Arash? Blow it! But what about him? This place was like a prison. How'd you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. Then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we it's went messed. through must have been worth something. You'd do the same thing to new kids. Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth, or kidnapped from colonies most ended up here the way i did but terry those pirates, darn batarians again they did such horrible things to us they must have had good reasons there's no reason good enough are you nuts you lived it i googled it change your socks right now Chad. <laughs> don't have socks on see another reason why socks are the devil <laughs> rip chum's eyes <laughs> bleaching them as we speak forgive the typos oh my goodness we can blow up the place but that still leaves him what do we do with another you that's easy just leave me here this is where i belong fuck that oh man killing him changes nothing or do do it <laughs> kill him <laughs> leave him alone obviously we're gonna say do it Oh boy, Anne Rosie. <laughs> Rim Trump eyes. All right, Anne Rose, redeeming a VIP gamble, going with 420 Blizzy Blap for Chum for the new trauma. So nice of you, Anne Rose. Good luck, Chum. 901. Oh, so close, but unlucky. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so close. No socks? Well, we're one soldier's hater. Another reason socks are the devil said the socks of sandals and bedwear. I would never. Yeah, it was, we're evil Kermit. Kermit, do it. You're here to erase your past. He's part of that. I... Shit. Is this right? Will killing him fix my head? Yes. You're a killer, Jack. That's what you do. Oh, no. Yeah. That felt... Oh, no. Good. We're turning Jack into us. Let's finish up. You're free. <laughs> God, leave him alone. She was a little too late for that. So close, so generous. Bullet in the head solves everything. <laughs> I know that now. This that should be my new childhood. motto. A bullet in the head Maybe solves everything. Take your time. No time. Go ahead. Nothing's changed, but it's all different. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. Jeez. I want to stop coming back here. You said you wanted to look around. I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. Never did any good. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. No. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. They didn't try to clean that at all, Instead, did they? I stopped him. Okay. No more wallowing. Let's blow this place Let's to Blow hell. her up. Oh, we didn't even get to see? Well, maybe we do. Ow! That's a huge explosion.
Maybe a little overkill, but I'm sure it felt good. <laughs> uh oh, all we added to the quote is great. <laughs> Jack Nocito. Is that a DeLorean? I, I don't think that's what they call it in this game. I think that's just like our little shuttle. All right, facility on Pragia, Pragia confirmed destroyed. Concerned that previous cleanup crew failed to destroy all records. Surviving facility scientists already dead, either from uprising or after facility shut down. Jack should have no further emotional issues distracting her from the mission. All right, we got warp ammo, nice. New outfit, uh, bio amp upgrade, plus 30% biotic damage. That's really good. I got I got a lot of things to upgrade, I think. Oh god. I'll deal with it. Take pictures. Joker. Touch me and I will smear the walls with you, bitch. Enough. Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me. One was away wrong. from two years, hard. It wasn't <gasps> Cerberus. Not really. But clearly you were a mistake. Screw you. You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. Oh boy. Okay, I don't know what's happening here with them. Uh, Mango, thank you so much for the 23 month Risa. Welcome back for another month. Thank you so much, Mango. How are you doing? 23 months in a row, too. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mango. I really appreciate it. How are you doing? It's good to see you. Hello, hello. We're having a good Tuesday. Looks like you have small legs. No further emotional issues? Yeah, I think we're far from that. <laughs> Uh, how's it been two years, right? Crazy. Well, I guess Elden Ring's been out for two years now, so <laughs> makes sense. But yeah, time really does fly. So good to see you, Mango. I hope you're doing well. All right, Jack said, screw you. You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. Okay, she's probably mad because Miranda is Cerberus also, and she's trying to get her emotions out. This is a distraction. This ends now. Back off, Miranda. Too bad, Jack. I'm gonna stay in the middle. This ends now. My opinion is the one that matters. You two, keep a deck apart at all times. She can't be trusted, Shepard. She'll jeopardize the whole mission. If we survive this, you two can tear each other apart. Until then, save your hate for the collectors. We could have picked sides. She'll survive. I'll make sure of it. Then, I'll tear you apart myself. Oh, jeez. Myself. You two gonna be okay? Oh, it's a good thing you came by when you did. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. Plus 15 renegade, whoops. <laughs> I mean, I feel like the renegade option was the best, you know? I didn't want to pick sides. I like them both. Do you think, I don't think Garrus is ready yet. I'm not gonna go talk to Garrus again. Nope. Nope, not dueling time. Full Terminator points, yep. Whoa. All right, we're gonna go, oh, feed the fish, feed the fish. <gasps> Hi, fish. They're so cute. All right, how's the space hammy? Oh. Still cute as ever. All right, let's go do upgrades. Whew. We're so renegade. Commander, you've received Hi, a new Stan. message at your private terminal. Oh, sweet, thank you. Thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you for the heist. Thank you. <laughs> I missed the first one. Hi, Snowman, how are you doing? Happy Tuesday. Hi, Earl Grey, good to see you too. Me talking about Garrus? I can't stop thinking about Garrus. What do I do? All right, unread message. An important request in all caps from Mr. Ganak Edchal. Dear sir or madam, having consulted with my colleagues at the Citadel, I have the privilege to request for your assistance to transfer a large quantity of Prothean technology uncovered at Ilos. 
Believing these materials to be a hazardous danger, they were locked in quarantine. Even though the test revealed that the fears were groundless, the quarantine remains in effect until one can pay for a permit to request a reclassification from the cultural ministry. Knowing of your interest in Prothean technology, I would be happy to deliver most of it into your hands, keeping less than half for myself. As a Batarian, I cannot engage in council official activities, but if you transfer the, tw the 20,000 credits required to me, this exchange could be made in your name, enabling us both to profit from this happy, ac <laughs> happy accident. Please reply urgently with your credit transfer account information. This sounds like a complete scam, okay? Who's Who would give this Batarian the 20,000 credits? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sir or madam? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Oof. All cult members deserve equal opportunity. Snacko funds. <gasps> Last. Thank you for the 100 bits, Snacko funds. Thank you so much. <laughs> equal opportunity to rig the heist. It's true. We shall not accept blackmail. <gasps> so rigged. Wow. I cannot believe you guys. Absolutely rigged. Lots of winners this time, too. The last heist had a lot of winners. This one, too. But y'all rigged it. I can't believe you. <gasps> Anne Rose, how could you? Five, how could you? So rigged. Winners pogs. Okay. PS5 fun. <laughs> Dan, thank you for the 400 bits to the PS5 fun. There is no PS5 fun, by the way, but thank you so much, Dan. I really appreciate it. Power of the cult. There's no cult. Okay. Um, definitely not. Nope. Nope. Get out of there. All right. We said we were going to do upgrades. PS5 fund. No. <laughs> Sweet. There's no PS5 fund. But thank you for the 100 bits. I appreciate it. Oh, assault rifle damage. And submachine gun damage, too. And assault rifle damage upgrade. Sure. All right, I need more iridium now. Oh, we got lots of armor upgrades. Element zero. Oh, all of this is element zero. I'll go for tech cooldowns and medigel capacity. I think we're maxed out on medigel capacity. Ooh, Krogan Vitality, sure. Nice. 500 for PS5 fund. There's no PS5 fund. <laughs> Cal, thank you for the 500 bits. I really appreciate no, it. Thank you, Cal. Anonymous! <laughs> oh my god. For the not PS5 fund. Oh my god. Anonymous! Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. You naughty stinking noodle. Hi, Dusky. Oh my god. Anonymous. Thank you so much for gifting a hundred subs to the community. Oh my god. Definitely A to the three. I don't know. I haven't seen A to the three in the chat, but maybe. I don't know. Anonymous, you stinky. Thank you so much for a hundred gift subs. It's way too many. Way too nice. I'm gonna cry. It's a lot of submarines. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate this. Way too nice. Thank you so much, whoever you are. Thank you, thank you. If you got gifted a sub, enjoy your emotes. Thank you so much, Anonymous. Um, and yes, no, maybe sure. Thank you for the hundred bits for the not PS5 fun. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> Good gracious, it's way too many. Yeah, holy guacamole. Money bags over here. Whoever it is. My goodness. I thought you said no PS5 fund. 
Mm -mm. New PC fund. No, no new PC fund. No, no. Don't need a new PC. Don't need a PS5. Dan, thank you for the 100 bits, though. <laughs> thank you so much. Uh, it's a lot of submarines. We love boats. It's an anonymous gifter, says right there. I don't know who you are, okay, anonymous, but you're a naughty noodle. Absolutely. Hi, Eddie. Good to see you. I am having a good Tuesday. How are you doing? Hello, hello. Anonymous is really anonymous. Naughty. Naughty. Thank you so much, though. It's really, really nice. All right. We just finished Jack's loyalty mission. Um, let's do... Let's start with the new dossiers. I don't... I'm guessing it doesn't matter which one I do first. But I think that two of them are on the same planet. So maybe we should go to that one. Maybe. Whatever planet that is. Me find Mr. Anonymous right now. Please do, Sundi, and report back. <laughs> We're gonna find you. All right, more probes, and then hit the mass relay. Let's see. Recruit Tali over here. Oh, it would be nice to have Tali. And then this is recruit the Justicar, recruit the assassin. Yeah, they're both in this one. Take cat. Okay, y'all said don't do Liara's quest just yet, right? Um, okay, no, maybe we should get Tali first then. Let's go get Tali. Yes, thank you, whoever you are. I'm glad you got a gift sub for Joel. Very nice. New McDonald's sauce, not good at all. What is the new McDonald's sauce? I saw there was a poll, but I didn't see what the, the poll said. <laughs> oh, boy. PS5 fund. <laughs> Chad, thank you for the 100 bits. No PS5 fun, but thank you, Chad. I really appreciate it. Your clues are leading to a Miss Anonymous. Ooh. Wait, how do you know, Cindy? <laughs> We're gonna find you. That wasn't creepy at all. No, sir. Yep. <laughs> Did I hear waifu Tali? I want to go. I want to find Tali. What is this? I'm wondering if I, if I flew into that, if I would explode. Okay. Scan the planets. You know what? Scanning planets is a good low energy activity, I think. Mm -hmm. Perfect day for this. What do we need? We need more iridium and element zero. And we could use more platinum. I'm pretty good on palladium, though. This is my subscription to Sundi's new detective show. <laughs> Andros, thank you for the 100 bids. I want a subscription to the Sundi detective show. Ooh, that's not very good iridium. This planet only... Oh, here we go. This planet only has moderate results. Away. You can, but for me, it didn't work. Probe launched. Oh my god, thank you guys so much for that hype train. Good gracious. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Y'all are way too generous. Too nice. Yo, we haven't found element zero on a planet in what feels like decades. I can't remember where I have found Element Zero on a planet, so we're probably never going to see it again. I think this means there's just the three planets. Little planet. Lots of palladium. The one I don't need. Oh, here we go. Probe launched. <gasps> Element Zero! Launching probe. Yes, finally. Hi, Yukiverse. Welcome in. Enjoy your gift sub. Enjoy your emotes. Ooh, double Broke peak. Away. Yeah, we finally found the element zero. The game must have heard me complaining. <laughs> There's still a lot of palladium here. I don't need that at all, but I'll take the element zero. Launching probe. I'll take the platinum too, why not? Probe. 
Take the iridium. I think that's about it. Oh! Just kidding. Probe away. Okay, now that's it. <clears throat> Rick and Morty sauce a couple years ago? I never tried that one either. I'm like a loyal sweet and sour sauce person through and through. Sweet and sour sauce for nuggies and fries. Yep. Columba has the- oh, just one more thing right before solving the case. Would Suni just spin around while holding a juice box? Yes. <laughs> My dino friend! Never tried the Rick and Morty sauce either. What did that one taste like if you had to describe it? You're getting like 25 Travis Scott meals though. <laughs> it was a cool idea. I, I kind of like they went through a phase where they had like celebs come in and like put together a meal that you could order But I feel like they don't do that anymore, right? I feel like that was a really good idea You can eat McDonald's sweet and sour on its own. It's so good. Hi cookie monster. I'm glad you got a gift sub. Hope you're having a good Tuesday Accurate bonk. Hi winter. I did have a good day. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well, too uh, We are scanning some planets trying to find Tali Cannot scan this one, but this is where Tali is. Oh, who should we bring? Jack got a new appearance. Oh, I like it. I like it. Love the new outfit. Looks better with the red. Let's see. I think I want to bring Grunt. What does he have again? Ooh, I don't. I do want to try out the Neural Shock. Okay, let's bring Morden and Grunt. I haven't tried out his new uh, Neural Shock yet. Mm hmm. Ooh, we can fully upgrade incinerate here. Or we can add some more into Neural Shock. But I could only add one here. Mm. Okay, let's put it in incinerate. Gosh darn it. Omni Blue, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good Tuesday. Sweet and sour sauce don't miss. It really doesn't. It's so good. And honestly, like, there's a lot of varieties of sweet and sour sauce, but the McDonald's one is by far my favorite. The one that I, like, I know I will like. There are sweet and sour sauces that I don't like. You love honey mustard for nuggets? I love honey mustard for salads. I always put honey mustard on my salads, but I don't use it for other stuff for some reason. So long ago, I remember uh, that was at least over a decade ago. <laughs> There's no way it was that long ago. <sighs> Hope you're having good days. Well, thank you. Thank you. You love the Snorlax? Me too. Me too. Never have your sweet chili sauce for your nuggies, but you whip up some sriracha mayo in that slabs. I bet that's good too. I like sweet chili for my uh, buffalo wings. Yeah. Sriracha mayo. What would be good with sriracha mayo? There's something that goes well with it, but I can't remember right now. Uh, you always ask for honey and then they give you honey mussy. Oh no. Yeah, the two are quite different, huh? What do you what do you use the honey for, Ann Rose? For your nuggies? Happy food talk emote. Yep. <laughs> a lot of that goes on here. One time we saw this guy in a hip hop video dip a perk in the sweet and sour hot rod. What? <laughs> Gosh darn it. All right. Heavy incinerate advanced plasma around melts or burns nearly anything it hits splash zone. Okay, we want the splash zone. Sweet and sour chicken, too much sugar? Oh, I'm sure there's a lot of sugar, but you, I love sweet stuff, so I have to. Okay, uh, we'll stick with everything that we have here. We'll stick with that for grunt, stick with that. Okay, what is this bug? Oh my God, it's on fire. Um, spontaneous combustion, I think is what we just observed. Oh, geez, what? 
Is that for real? Don't go in the sun, it's very dangerous, apparently. I'm gonna have to sign and see if anything happens. Can you rate from worst to best? McDonald's, Burger King, Wendy's. Uh, Burger King worst, uh, then Wendy's, and McDonald's is best. Yep. Easy. Sea and sour is a basic Karen sauce in tea. <laughs> Gosh darn it, I hate you. Why? I love sweet and sour sauce. You put starch and mayo in your California rolls too. Ooh, nuggy is so good with honey. That actually makes sense because honey goes really well with fried chicken. So that makes a lot of sense. Honey on nuggies. Yeah, I got to try that. Just honey, where's the mussy? Both honey and honey mussy would be good on nuggies, I would say. Oh no, it's bad. It's bad. It's actually bad. Out of the sun. Get out of the sun, Grunt, faster! Grunt is over here trying to sunbathe. Okay, there's probably nothing down there. Solar radiation is affecting shields. Unpleasant. Where did so I know? Fight for the shade, but no hiding. Yikes! That depletes your shield so quickly. Sealed. Authorization Cal Rieger. Migrant Fleet Marines. Okay. We got a door. Emergency log entry. The gates are here. I've stayed to buy the other's time. Anyone who gets this, find Dali's aura. She and that data are all that matters. Keep oh, dang. Oh, money? Oh, that's how you open the gate, I see. Open sesame. Grunt wants a tan. I think that that is what he wants. You can't with all these BK stands. Wait, who's saying BK is the best? Burger King Oreo cake is going in what? <laughs> but who's going to Burger King to get dessert, right? Wendy's is the best chicken sandwich. The ghost pepper chicken sandwich is wonderful. I love the McChicken though. The McChicken hits hits the right spot. But me when Burger King is my favorite. Oh no, Ann Rose. I mean, I haven't been to Burger King in a long, long, long time. Long, long time. It's it's not just me. Like I said, my family is like a loyal McDonald's family. All my cousins, we are all McDonald's stands. So it runs in the blood, okay? I didn't pick McDonald's. McDonald's picked me. <laughs> You'd rather eat dirt than a Burger King? BK had the cheese, tater tots, and mozzarella. Wow, BK getting fancy. Everybody take out your pitchforks. <laughs> A Whopper? Is that Burger King? I think it is, right? You've been hitting that BK Impossible Burger and they have onion rings. So they have onion rings too? I didn't know this. I do love a good onion ring. McChicken's a masterpiece. Thank you, especially when fresh and hot. Yep. Mm -hmm. McChicken's are great, right? I always get McChicken nuggies and fries. So that's my order at McDonald's. <laughs> um, occasionally a Big Mac, but more often not because like... If you make me chick between, if you make me pick between a McChicken and a Big Mac, like n <laughs> nine times out of ten, I'm gonna pick the McChicken. One more worst to best: Pizza Hut, Papa John's, and Domino's. That is real. That's actually pretty tough. Okay, and y'all might hate me for saying this, but I'll explain why. I'll explain why I rank it this way. I would say Pizza Hut's the worst. And that's because when I was little, growing up, Saturdays were pizza days at my family, and my family always got Pizza Hut, and they loved Pizza Hut. I did not particularly enjoy Pizza Hut, but I ate so much Pizza Hut that I'm officially sick of it. So I would say Pizza Hut's the worst. Then I would put Domino's in the middle. Domino's would be the worst, but they changed their formula, their recipe, and now it's actually good. So I would put Domino's in the middle. If it wasn't for Papa John's, Domino's would be the best, but I am a Papa John's pizza stan, not not Papa John, but the pizza, love their pizza. It's it's the bread. It's all about the bread for me, so I feel like they have the best uh, pizza dough. McChicken's on the Mount Rushmore fast food staples. Thank you. I'm glad you agreed, Chum. Burger King has a great veggie burger. I feel like all of these chains should have a veggie burger if they don't. McNasty. Wow, Steve, you take that back. I've not had Culver's, no. McD's breakfast Burger King Whop Burger King Whopper. Wendy's chocolate frosty. What about the hot fudge sundae? Hot fudge sundae from McDonald's slaps. 
Burger King's one of the only ones with a decent veggie burger. Oh, okay, okay. I think that's fair, Virgil, yeah. You like Pizza Hut Hot Rod? I feel like a lot of people do. I feel like I'm the odd one out. You think franchise pizza is heinous? Compared to like a local pizza spot, yes. But sometimes you want, you want the cheap, fast pizza. <laughs> Making really good breakfast biscuits. McGriddle! Get a Mc... Y'all, get a McGriddle, okay? It'll change your life, I promise. You only love Pizza Hut when you had enough book it. Oh, the personal pizzas. Oh, those were so good. Those were good because I got to pick my toppings instead of eating the ones that my parents... Okay, so my parents always got, like, veggie pizza. And when I was little, I did not like vegetables, you know, as most kids don't. So I picked, like, all the veggies off. I hated it. Now, I always get, like, the veggie or the supreme pizza because I love veggies. But when I was little, I didn't like it. So that was another reason why I didn't like the pizza. You don't care much for pizza anyway. Domino's gave your family food poisoning and put your parents in the hospital in the 90s? I didn't go back for decades. Yeah, that would scar me for sure. We're deaf, not Papa John's stands. Nope. Pizza Hut bake pasta bakes? I haven't tried anyone's pasta bakes, I don't think. Uh, that fu hot fudge sundae. Hot fudge sundae is so good. It's so good. It's basically the McDonald's like soft cone with hot fudge on it. And it's so good. Connecticut has the best local pizza in the country, five, sure. <laughs> no to pizza chains, yes to pizzerias, yeah. Mo now, nowadays, I mostly get pizza from like local pizza places, but every once in a while, you know, I, I go for the Papa John's or the Domino's. Costco's the fastest and best by far, <laughs> I don't care. I would get Costco pizza too, but I don't have Costco membership. The griddle will change your life, it's so good. So you know I was recently been like shocked by the price of fast food. You got to make Yes. This was me at burrito or burrito at Chipotle. Another boomer moment. I got Chipotle recently and my burrito bowl cost 10 bucks. And I was like, I feel like I was at Chipotle yesterday and my burrito bowl cost seven bucks. I was like, what in the world happened? Uh, you got a McDonald's coupon today and it was two can dine for $16.99. I'm like, uh, is this gourmet or <laughs> that's actually crazy. So many pizzerias, you just can't fathom picking a uh, chain over any of them. I think that's fair, yeah. Another call announcement. We have Froyo Fridays. <laughs> I love Froyo, God. This is not helping my cause of trying to convince you guys it's not a cult. Pizza and veggies can be weird tasting. Really good salad bar, though. It was, it was just, there were so many different veggies that I didn't like. Like, I didn't like peppers. I didn't like tomatoes. I didn't like mushrooms. I didn't like uh, olives. I didn't like any of the pizza or the veggie toppings they put on there. So I just picked them all off. And then it just had, like, a weird, like, tomato-y aftertaste. Tomato-y aftertaste. I get that it's pizza, but it was, like, the aftertaste of the soft, squishy <laughs> tomatoes that they put on top. <laughs> Quality is down and uh, shrinkflation to the food. Basically just worth it to eat at a proper local restaurant. Yeah. I haven't tried a McRib. No, I need to though before I kick the bucket. You had a McRib once and it made you want to vom? Someone had it recently and said it was okay. It's not even inflation anymore. Big Corp is greedy. Down with the bougie. Hi, Tom. Welcome in. How are you doing? Totally not a cult. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Definitely not a cult here. <laughs> Green peppers on pizza is terrible. No, no, green peppers is like my go-to topping now. It's always green peppers and sausage. Green peppers I love now. When I was little, I hated it, but now I love it. My taste buds changed quite a bit. You had three McRibs in the month they had it out here. Three? You can go another 10 years now. Why did you have three? And you're like, gross. Remember the frozen McRib meat before it gets fried? I, no, 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 I don't want to look at that. I don't want to see any uncooked McDonald's food, I don't think, you know? If I did, I'm sure I would be scarred and never want McDonald's again. <laughs> Which is probably drop for the best. Oh, one. no! Okay. What did you drop off? Oh, a bunch of guests. The oh, they're fast! <gasps> I did not know! These guys are quick. Oh. Enjoy. We got him. Oof. Nothing can hurt me. <laughs> Grunt. Green peppers is a place on pizza. Absolutely. And onions. Even black olives. Yep. Oh, there's more. So I was trying to explore, I didn't know. 
Grunts down. I got you. I got you. Please accept my vision's oh. change in lieu of gifting it forward. Tom, thank you for the 300 bits. I really appreciate it. No, absolutely no need to gift it forward. Thank you so much, Tom. I really, really appreciate that. That's really nice. I want to thank the anonymous gifter. Yes, thank you, anonymous, whoever you are. You really had two on back-to-back -back days. I got excited, okay? You're like, let me have one and let me have another one just to make sure. <laughs> Your mobile can't be gifting. No, absolutely no need to gift Tom. I just hope you enjoy your gift sub and your emotes. But thank you, thank you for the bits. It's really generous. Super size me. Yes, we talked about that recently too. You lived on green pepper and black olive pizza in college. Really good toppings now. I can't believe there's a point in my life where I didn't like it because now it's like all I want on a pizza. But yeah, that happened. <laughs> Oh, who is this? Is that Grunt? Grunt, what are you doing up there? Oh, in the sun. Oh my god, Grunt, you were in the sun. I forgot about that. I totally forgot. Tom, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, I forgot. We can't be in the sun. We will fly to a crisp. Gr Grunt's just up there in the sun sunbathing. He gives zero hex. Oh my god, he's gonna die. He is gonna die. Oh no. Grunt, get out of the sun. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh god, he's trying to... Okay, okay, I see. I see. Grunt, there's gotta be a better way to do this, my friend. Path is too well lit. Too much sunlight. We need to find an alternate route. Alternate route? Morden, I don't I don't know where. Here, enjoy. Don't you duck? Oh, I missed. <laughs> Someone froze him. Get back there. Are they just gonna keep sending the gas? <gasps> They're climbing. Nothing can hurt me. <laughs> I know there's more. I don't know where they went. Oh no. Olives right in the Triss can. I totally understand why people don't like olives. Black olives are the only olives I like too. The green ones, I've tried so many times because I'm like, I want to be cool and enjoy green olives, but I just don't. I just can't. I need to find ammo. <clears throat> Her eyes went right over your mouth. Oh, hi, Giffy. Hello, how are you doing? I didn't even see you come in. I'm so sorry. We can Customize use this. heavy pistol. How are you doing, Giffy? I was totally, totally in the, <laughs> the mission for a minute there. Oh, you know Cookie, how cool. Um, you got Anonymous gifted sub too. Yep, yep, Anon was very, very generous. You like black olive mushroom onion sausage on your pizza? I, I still say no to the mushroom, but that's more for like texture reasons, but everything else I can get down with, yeah. Olives, do you like all the olives, Lumen? I can only handle black olives. Anything else is too, um, is it salty, sour? How would you describe the taste of olives? It makes my face pucker, you know? Black olives on pizza are great, but there's a number where it's too many and the number is pretty low. <laughs> I used to put black olives in my salads too. Yeah, I like black olives, I do. I can't like eat them by themselves. I think it's too, it's too strong that way, but on a pizza I think is good and on, on a salad too. Tangy, maybe, yeah. I don't know, it's so hard to describe. It's definitely like a mix of flavors though. You would eat anchovies over olives. I've never tried anchovies on a pizza. I don't think I would like that though. They're also bad on pizza. I feel like anchovies don't belong on pizza. <laughs> sour and salty, okay. Tart, tart, okay. It's probably like a combo of sour, salty, and tart. Yeah. Uh, 
It's just odd. Really selling you on the olives? No, no, black olives, chum. Just the black ones, not the green ones, not the Kalamata ones, just the black ones. They also have these fancy, like, stuffed olives. Sometimes they're stuffed with, I think, like, some sort of cheese, I don't know, but... Those ones make me think that maybe I could enjoy olives, but I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Anchovies are super yummy. Oh, probably just not for me, you know. All right, I don't like this whole sun burning me situation, so we got to figure out where to go. It wants me to go this way, where the Gath are. Oh my God, we're gonna die. Oh no, we're good. We're good. Oh, we got iridium too. Nice. Oh, and I see ammo. Perfect. I want to go up there because me there might be something there. We gotta get the ammo, though. Oh, no. Nothing can hurt me. <laughs> Grunt, please. Please stop shouting that. Okay, there's probably nothing up there. That's what I'm gonna say. I, I can't be bothered to go look. Horse and like calamari pizza, but not into a horse? Garlic stuffed olives, yes, that sounds right. Hi, Red Penguin, how are you doing? Good to see you. Hello, hello, hope you're having a great Tuesday. Um, do I see your Red Penguin? <laughs> you love snacking on olives with a glass of white wine. See, Mingo, you're living my dream. I wanna be that person, but <laughs> it's totally not me. Someone, who are they shooting at? Full cryo blast, hit him. I oh my god, Grunt. <laughs> when they fall over from being frozen, it's great. Oh, damaged Geth Hunter. Wait, no! He disappeared. I got a new submachine gun that a lot of people can use. It's nice. Uh oh. I'm here to help. They're all dead. <laughs> Dude, what? They're all dead. Uh, horse is common in Italy, which is where I had it. Like horse meat? Really? You and friend used to try and drink the olive juice from the jar. That's like people who drink pickle juice, which I think is more common than I'm realizing. But yeah, I de definitely not a fan of the pickle juice. Nope. <laughs> Can I remember what it tastes like though? Probably chicken. Yeah. How was my day? Thank you for asking. Oh, you had a burrito. Very nice for a penguin. I'd go for a burrito. Burrito's so good. This is Commander Shepard of the Normandy. I'm afraid I don't see any Quarian survivors here. Did I kill Shepherd. the besties? Oh, dear. What's your current status? Where are you? I hope I didn't just accidentally kill Quarian teammates. That may have been what happened. Pickle and olive juices are good broth and stew bases. I feel like I would stick with chicken, chicken stock. Is that what it's called? Chicken broth? Uh, shuriken, that's a ninja throwing star, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh no. <laughs> There's no command for bit alerts or alerts. I don't know what you're looking for, Tom. Need hugs, but decided to drink wine instead. <laughs> oh dear. That's a good alternative, I guess. Yeah. Uh, bean, cheese, chicken, salsa, guacamole, and a touch of sour cream. Okay. <laughs> it's another thing. I went to Chipotle recently, right? And I was like, just a little bit of sour cream. And they take the spoon and they're like, whoop. <laughs> All this sour cream. I'm like, okay, I guess it's fine. Tom likes alerts. We just have, um, there's not like unique, a lot of unique bit alerts. Uh, it's all just like the standard ones. Yeah. I owe you guys unique bit alerts though. Oh, and there's TTS. You can customize the TTS of your, uh, bits. Yeah. TTS is the name of the game here. Thank you. You guys pick your alerts. Choose your alerts. <laughs> all right. Core numbers, core mission, get arrival. What's Let's the start here. Of your team? How many of you are left? We were a small squad, dozen Marines plus the science team. We're down to half strength now. May the synthetic bastards pay for it, though. 
Uh huh. What brought you this deep into Geth-controlled space? You're asking the wrong person, Shepard. I just point and shoot. Something about the sun is going bad faster than it should. Some kind of energy problem. Yeah, we figured that out. Any idea where the Geth came from? One of the patrol ships found us. Drop ships started raining Geth down on our heads before we could get off the world. Systems under Geth control. We knew they made planetary sweeps periodically. We hoped going low emissions would hide us. Are more on the way? Do we have to worry about the Geth sending in reinforcements? I don't think so. Their patrol ship hasn't lifted off again. The radiation blocks all off-world communication. What's your current position? Bunker down at base camp across the valley. I left Tally Zora at a secure shelter, then double back to hold the choke point. Getting Tally out safely is our top priority. If you can extract her, we'll keep him off you. Tally still alive? You're willing to die? Avocado, avodico, 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 avocado, avodico. Oh, it's the hashtag free gorb. I think it's I don't know why Brian pronounces the the text and the emoji differently. That's so weird. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. I'm kind of a volcano, a volcano, a volcano, 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 a volcano, a volcano. It sounds like Eminem saying I'm walking, I'm walking, I'm walking. <laughs> Good you started. Tom, thank you for the 300 bits. Sweet, thank you for the 100 bits. Last, thank you for the 100 bits as well. Cookie, thank you for the follow. Thank you guys so much. What in the unholy name? You have a friend who uses pickle juice in her bevies. There is something called a pickleback, Lumen, where you take like a shot of pickle juice and a shot of whiskey. Avocado. <laughs> Avocado, 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 Hikari, are you okay? <laughs> And I was thinking for the hundred bits. So random pauses in there, and then it got really loud at the end. Thank you, Anne Rose. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hi, Sylph. Pickle, <laughs> pickle back, pickle back, not pickle bath. <laughs> pickle back. You've had pickle backs many times. You also drink too many bevies. I've had a pickle back. I think maybe one time, and it was not good. <laughs> Hi, Tida. How are you doing? I'm sensing a theme. I don't think she was going to ever stop. There's a lot of avocados there. I love avocado. You're willing to die? You to throw your life away for research? Negative. I'm gonna give my life for the migrant fleet. All the difference in the world. I'm no tech expert, Shepard. I'm a marine. They tell me to shoot. I shoot. They said to protect Tally and the data. You get them out safe. I've done my job. Hmm. You got confirmation that the Geth haven't reached Tally yet? Affirmative. Left my best men with her. When you get here, you can talk to her. <laughs> avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, slash. Slash, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico. Avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado, avodico, avocado. Oh no, Brian! Brian's like too many avocados. Tom, thank you for the 300 bits. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, hi, Timber Ghost. How are you doing? It's so good to see you. <gasps> hi, Jawhead. Good to see you too. You changed your name color. The ASMR play? I can't tell. Stream is hijacked. 
I can't tell if the ASMR play scammed. Scammed? Hi, Jawhead. How are you doing? It's so good to see you. Let me see if I can replay it. I, I didn't hear it, but it could have been so quiet that I missed it. Are we rejoining Tali? We are trying to rejoin Tali. It's true. Oh no, maybe I can't fix it. Oh no! Oh no, I don't know how to replay it. Oh, thank you, Sweet, for the 100 bits, though. The scam! I'm so sorry. Thank you, Sweet. So you've come at a time of avocado chaos. A lot of avocado chaos. <laughs> how are you doing, though? It's so good to see you. Timber goes, I haven't won any heists yet today. It's because you weren't here. Hi, Jawhead. Good to see you, too, friend. Hope you're having a wonderful Tuesday. And Ravon with the VIP gamble going with nine. Hello, all you beautiful people. Hello, you. 431. Ah, oh, so close, but unlucky. Good try. Thank you, Jawhead, for the 100 bits. How are you doing? It's good to see you, friend. Who is Tali? All I know is a is Avo a Avodico. <laughs> Scam people sad now. Soon we'll be able to feed their kids. All I can say is it's all for ASMR failure. <laughs> there was one ASMR that actually sounded really nice. I can't remember what it was though. Timber goes loses all the time. Why would you want to be there for heist? Because I lose all the time, Cal. But when you have someone to lose with, it makes the losing not as bad, you know? Shepard, scan <laughs> the area and located the demolition charges the quarry commander mentioned. Put it on my radar. Done. You will need both sides uh -oh, charges uh -oh. to clear the rubble. Okay, this is bad. Oh my god, someone's invisible. Okay, you yikes. Oh, jeez, they were invisible. Okay. Now we gotta watch out for Rogue Geth and the sun. Too late. Now you're dead. <laughs> Grunt, please. Morden, get out of the sun, please. Y'all, if you just got here. I'm on a mission, we're trying to find Tali, and the sun is trying to melt us, okay? It's giving me PTSD from last year when Nothing I fainted because it was so me. hot. I don't even want to go there. I don't even care what's there, I'm not getting it. Warrior on oh. radio mentioned demolition charges. Use those to clear the rubble. Demolition charges. I don't I don't think I know what they said Friendly or what they're fire, talking Shepard. about. Nice. Okay. I need you here so you can suffer with me. <laughs> well, when you suffer together, am I the only one who feels that way? Like when you have someone else to suffer with, it's not as bad. But if you're suffering alone, it's like infinitely worse. I can't be the only one who feels that way, right? It's only Tuesday, sadly. <laughs> the most accurate bonk you've ever seen. Bonka heist rigger chum. <laughs> someone who despises ASMR project. Yep. Also checks out. Mission pointer will point to them? Oh, okay. Okay, perfect. You like suffering together. Thank you. Thank you, Timber Ghost. I like suffering together too. Strong. Fried pearl on avocado toast. I love it on Sunday. Dan, thank you for the 100 bits. I appreciate Thank you, Dan. I think the Geth are just gonna keep Hippo arriving, maybe. Yeah, they are. Okay, I gotta do something. Get ready to fight. Ah! Gotta go that way. I'm running. You guys take care of the Geth. I'm running. No, it wants me to go this way. It wants me to go where the geth are coming from? Oh, okay. Wait, that was grunt. I'm sorry. Oh, no.
They just keep arriving though. Oh, neural shock. I forgot to try that out. Nothing to help. Uh oh. Worthless. Dude, how many baddies are there? <gasps> Wait. Yes, melt them. Oh, here we go. Demolition charge. Tally's journal. We need a core sample to get a timeline on the rate of radiation increase, but our equipment keeps dying on us. Shepard once used a mining laser to clear some rubble back on Therum. Maybe I can do something similar with demolition charges. Okay. But we win all of them now, yes. No, not copium. <laughs> not copium at all. Humans love to commiserate. I'm with you, but saying you need someone to suffer with hits different. No, I wouldn't I wouldn't bring someone down, okay? But if we're both suffering anyway, yeah, let's do it together. You know? Oh, now they're coming from that way. Headed for combat. Too late. Now you're dead. I'm gonna zap them all. It's not working as well as I thought it was going to. Combat bros. Did Grunge just call us combat bros? What? <laughs> Hello? Alright, I think- Oh my god, Grunge. I think we gotta go back this way now. What was that heinous sound? Uh oh. Okay, okay, run, run. Oh. Not enough charge to clear- Not enough charge! Oh. Okay, we gotta find more charge, I think. Let's grunt, okay. Ah! Oh, he's shouting. Uh-oh. Yo, this mission is crazy. What is this?! The fire? The f oh my god, the fire? Oh, we are so dead. Oh my god, what? <laughs> Gets people. That made you jump. Got some points feeling heisty. Game wants you to go into ambush, yeah. He did say one of two charges. I think I missed it in all the chaos. Destroyers, you had a Mass Effect 1. They just do more Mass Effect 2, I see. Okay, at least they put me back here and not... Oh, jeez. Oh my god, Grunt, please. Um, I still have the particle beam out. Get him! Oh, no, they got me. Oh, they got him. Okay, okay, okay. <clears throat> Dude, these geth are strong. Grunt! Just vaulting over the boxes. Too late. Now you're go, go, go. Oh, oh. oh no. Ooh. Get the big guy. Nothing can hurt me. Ooh, someone's hurting me. Oh, this guy. Are we good? Nope, we're not good. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, I'm in the sun. It's a meridian. This way, I think. <gasps> what 
What is this? Med station. Nice. Power cells. Nice. Here we go. All right. We got two of two charges. Now we should be good to blow the thing up. Okay. Okay. Yep. I should have known. Oh. Jeez. Okay. Oh, wait. That's grunt. That's grunt. Morden, Morden. No, not the, not this dude again. No, get him. Someone's down. Morden. Where do y'all need to hide? Take cover! On the ground, now, now. Dude, there's so many ah. enemies! Down. <laughs> this mission. Ah. I feel like the enemies are all just respawning. Run, go, go. Should be enough. Have to move quickly. Large impact radius. Okay, okay. Run, run, run. Go. Ooh, that was crazy. <clears throat> A monster of cookies. Oh, mid year. All right, I need ammo, but I don't have any. Okay, what is this? <gasps> no! What is happening? Disassembled Geth rifle. Oh, ammo here. Corian architecture. Old buildings before Geth uprising. Fascinating. Why do we care? Anyone choosing to come here should be on their own. Journal. Hold on. Let's get this safe. You can change your loadout here. Tali's ordered to base camp. Come in base camp. Tali? Tali? Thanks, someone who has Tali's a huge wagon. <laughs> I don't even know how to respond. Enjoy your dumpy, yes. Could only be so lucky. Tully called us a friend. Tully. Tully's ordered to base camp. Come in base camp. Tully, Tully. Hello? Is anyone there? No one else is left. I am. Tally, it's Shepard. Shepard? Uh, I'm not complaining, but you show up at the strangest times. What are you doing in the middle of get space? I came to help. Let's get out of here first. I'm recruiting you. I do want to recruit her though. <laughs> Sounds means acceptance, so it's true. Way more proficient at uh, linking the dots than I ever was at Frogger. <gasps> I was a Frogger queen. What do you mean, Saint Dreamer? <laughs> I do think the dots game is a lot easier, but yeah, yeah. Frogger, Frogger was just panic mode every single time, you know. Uh, hi Archimedes, how are you doing? Good to see you. Hello, hope you're having a wonderful Tuesday. We need Tally in the party, please. I need her in the party. Absolutely. Yes, thank you, Mons. I came to help. Let's get out of here first. I'm recruiting you. Well, I want I want Tally on my side, and I don't know if that's gonna scare her off, so I'm gonna go with this I was one. In the neighborhood. I thought you might need a hand. Thanks for coming, Shepard. It means a lot to hear your voice. Tally. Carl Rieger and what's left of the Marines got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. I got the data I needed and I'm safe for now, but I've got a lot of geth outside. What is this research you're after? It's about this world's sun. It's aging faster Oh, that's why the sun looks so strange. Once we've got fewer geth shooting at us. Would it 
might help if I brought in the Normandy. Doubtful. These buildings are centuries old. If you bring down heavy fire, this whole place could collapse on us. Is anyone else still with you, or are you alone out there? Rieger had a team of Marines covering me when I ran for the observatory. At least some of them are still alive. I can hear them firing at the gas outside. All right. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the Geth, and the console's damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. <laughs> Thank the mod. <laughs> we love the mod. Okay, keep Rieger alive. Oh dear, it sounds like it's going to be tough. I'll take the Paragon points for Tali for sure. All right, she said we got to go th like through a field to get I to her. This. Uh oh. Oh no. Those drones went invisible. <gasps> There's so many. Oh no. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to deal with the drones. Now you're dead. Not typical. Next. Okay. There's still one. Morden's just hiding. No, there's more. There's so many. Oh, this gun? Oh my god, this gun. Oh my god, this gun. Not difficult. Oh my god, this gun. Okay. <laughs> Why did he say it like that? Jawhead, thank you for the hundred bits. I really appreciate it. Thank you, Jawhead. Eminem always has the weirdest TTS. Alright, let's see. It wants us to go this way. I don't want to get in the sun. I am Cromworthless. <laughs> oh, down. this drone. <laughs> oh, more drones. I don't know why this gun is doing this right now. Okay. There's more. Feel the blood rush. Ooh, big guy. So many drones! Besties! He's almost down. Oh, we got him. I am Krogan. <laughs> Thank you, Grunt. Oh no, another <laughs> one. Oof. You're up. <laughs> Dude, the drones! The drones! Oh. Mm. I gotta be careful. Enjoy. I hate those 
those sounds. Okay. Yeesh! You saw the sun open up your eyes, you saw the sun. <laughs> Bonanza. Uh, did Grunt just say I am worthless? Come on, Grunt, have some self esteem. No. He would never. Grunt is Krogan, it's true. Alright, I think we need to just get to that door. I think that's what we just need to do. That one's locked. Safe. Okay. Uh oh. This giraffe again. Colossus. Problematic. <laughs> Get down. I remember that getting one shot by that beam so this many times. Is why I follow you, Shepherd. Big things. Oh shoot! Not the. <laughs> Get ready to fight. Oh, God. That beam. Oh, that shield. What do we do? Just the thing to help. I don't think so. Okay, let's get the little... Oh, nope. I'll focus on the giraffe. You guys get the little guys. Hmm. Here, let's try particle beam. Stab him! Watch out, piece of crap's repairing itself. Repairing? Oh no, I forgot he could do that. Okay, we gotta move. Big ones, back up. Oh wait, that's a friend! That's a friend, my bad. Over here! Get to cover! <laughs> this is the person we're supposed to protect and keep alive. Rieger, migrant fleet marines. Are you high radio before that drop ship arrived? I still got no idea why you're here. This ain't the time to be picky. Uh oh. Callie's inside over there. Geth killed the rest of my squad, and they're trying to get to her. Best I've been able to do is draw their attention. Is she safe? What's the opposition like? Oh dear. Mission or all tally missions are funnier if you bring Legion along. I don't know what that is. You can normally, this one is special. We heist it. Yep. <laughs> Stop warning the rig lord. Uh, is she safe? What's the opposition like? How many Geth are out there? The Geth are near platoon strength, but the Colossus is the worst part. It's got a repair protocol. Yeah, but we gotta deal with that. Itself. Can't get a clear <gasps> shot. Like no. I tried to move in closer, one of the bastards oh, no. a shot through my suit. Uh, oh, we gotta investigate. Timber goes, how could you? Are we spoiling? Do please don't spoil anything, please. Yeah, if you don't know if I've seen something or if I don't have something, please don't mention it. Yeah. Uh it's okay, Timber Ghost. Bounce and fair and base and goaded. Alright. How bad is your suit damage? Combat seals clamp down to isolate contamination and I'm swimming in antibiotics. The Geth might get me, but I'm not gonna die from an infection in the middle of a battle that's just insulting. <laughs> what can you tell me about the battlefield? Right side's got a catwalk with a sniper perch. You could wreak some havoc from there. None of my men made it past the Geth. Middle's got cover, but the damn Colossus has a clear shot at you the whole time and you've got Geth coming in from both sides. The left gives you some cover from the Colossus, but your ass is hanging Okay, I think I gotta death. go left. That's I don't wanna I get hit shot. by the giraffe, because that's bad news. Any ideas on how to deal with the Colossus? Standard protocol with armature class units is to sabotage the shields and whittle it down, you know? Kill it with bug bites. But the repair protocol blows that plan to hell. You try to wear it down, it just huddles up and fixes itself. So whatever we do, has to scrap that bastard fast. Probably means getting up close, past that cover. Okay. We need to get to Tally. 
Got any ideas? Just one. I'm not moving so well, but I can still pull a trigger. Rocket launcher. Rocket launcher that the Let's sun go. Hasn't tried yet. You move in close. I'll keep the Colossus busy. Maybe even drop its shields. Luck. Okay. You'll be able to finish it off. No stay down. Sounds like a plan. Good luck, Rager. Oh god, he's gonna die, Let's isn't go he? Shoot some Geth. Give us a lie. Uh, say hi to Tally for me. Oh no. Ah, Tally has to keep him alive. Wow. Time to fight. Okay. Um. Feel the blood rage. Oh, yikes! Oh, I got hit by the giraffe already. Oh, again. Oh my goodness. I need to be careful. Uh oh. Oh no, this is bad. I got hit by like two orbs back to back. Too late. Now you're dead. How do you like that? No, no, start with the orbs. Stop it. Oh, I'm gonna die. Gosh darn it. Oh, now I don't eat grass for dinner. <laughs> I think there's something wrong with me. I made my first DD2 character in like five minutes. How did you do that so fast? Bro, how much you like Rieger? I think he's not gonna make it, sadly. You pre ordered uh, DD2, very nice for a penguin. Your character's a handsome young man. I love it. Rieger's a good man. You want DD2 so bad? Gonna try and get it soon. Nice. It's coming out really soon. Any impression the guests don't like you very much? No. No, I don't know. There's a lot of enemies here in that. Giraffe keeps hitting me. I gotta figure out a better strat for this. Um. They let you repick this decision. Okay. Say hi to Tally for me. Yeah, they gave me 15 renegade. I'm pretty sure he's gonna die. Okay, watch out for the orbs. Do the trick. Oh. Nothing can hurt me. <laughs> Run, please. Making contact. Yikes. Okay, I'm running. For the fleet. Oh. Uh. Oh no, there's so many people coming. I am Okay. <laughs> Get him! I keep like one eye on the orb and one eye on the gift. Alright, I think we need to try to move in. Okay, they said he's repairing himself. Oh, I'm in the sun! My no! shields are down. No! Okay, get out of the Too sun. Late. Now you this! Son of a bitch! Okay, the Come on, Rieger. 
How do I deal with those shields? Oh, maybe particle beam here? No! It's, oh, it's recovering. Oh no. Too late. Oh no. Okay, okay. <laughs> Bad idea. Bad idea. Maybe don't come here. I need the other guy. I need the bestie to uh, interrupt him. Uh -oh. Nothing can hurt me. Oh my God! The geth just keep coming. God, I got so greedy. <laughs> Trap. We say at least 30 minutes in character creation. It takes me like close to two hours, I think. How many hours will Chu spend in character creation? Eight hours? <laughs> oh God, we were making good progress. Eight hours is way too long. No, I think the most I spend is like two hours. Good luck, Rieger. Solaire would love it here. Oh, he would. Say hi to Tally for me. I don't know what to do when we get that close. I don't know if that was the best position to be in, like that close. It was good when um our bestie was distracting him. Next, I am Krogan. Oh my god, what just exploded? Neutralized. Oh. I am Good gracious. Cryoblast. I'm gonna run up this way. So many enemies. <laughs> There's so many. I didn't know this mission was gonna be so tough. Oh my goodness. Get him. Get him. Nice grunt. Nice job, bestie. All right, we're in the sun. Get oh my, my god, get out of the sun. Okay, it's repairing itself here. I think that's fine. Oh my god. Okay, particle beam here. Okay. repairing itself. Akila. Looks like I got its attention. Big ones, back up. Oh my god, it keeps repairing itself. Okay, so after some point, it'll just automatically go repair itself. I gotta be in 
in place so I can attack it even when it's ducking. Um, good against armor, this oh. one. Almost there. Oh. Nice! The last gap, not me. going down. Okay, we got him. more emergency lockdown in effect okay too late now you're dead i think i could go back on the other side to get something we need a choosy krogan for grunt <laughs> oh god there's more okay maybe we just need to kill all the remaining geth Here we go. Nice. Whew. Come and go back this way now. Jeez, that was tough. If choosy Bussin isn't real, we riot. You accept the bonking as the present Geth infiltrator. How do you have time to be a Geth, Geth infiltrator with the Babby? Yeah, that's a good question. <laughs> Uh-oh. Just let me finish this download. Tali? <gasps> Tali! Thank you, Shepard. If not for Ooh. you, I would never have made it out of this room. This whole mission has been a disaster. I wish I'd joined you back on Freedom's Progress, but I couldn't let anyone take my place on something this risky. Can you join me now? The Quarians owe me. I can't. A lot of Quarians lost their lives here. Was it worth it? I don't know, Shepard. It wasn't my call. The Admiralty Board believed the information here was worth sacrificing all our lives for. I have to believe that they know what's best. I didn't ask what some Admiral thought. I asked what you thought. A lot of people died here. Some of them were my friends. All of them were good at their jobs. That damn data better be worth it. The price was too high. What can you tell me about your research here? Haystrom's sun is destabilizing. Back when this was a Quarian colony, it was a normal star. It shouldn't change that quickly. What's causing this? Any idea what's destabilizing the sun? If I had to guess, I'd say that it was dark energy affecting the interior of the star. The effect is similar to when stars blow off mass to enter a red giant phase. But Haystrom's son is far too young for this to be natural. <gasps> Can you join me now? I'm gonna ask her to join us. I hope she says yes. <clears throat> they finalize the new emotes or still need ideas. I've commissioned, I think, six emotes. Um, so all of those have ideas. But if you have more ideas, feel free to share them with me. I'm all ears. Um, the new artists that I found uh, showed me some rough sketches and they look really good. So I'm probably going to end up commissioning more after uh, the first set gets delivered. Yeah. Tally, join us, please. <laughs> Tally's accent's so cool. I love Tally. Tinfoil hat must have. There's got to be a tinfoil hat emo on BTTV, right? Take a look at BTTV first. If you can find a good one, send it to me and I'll add it. If you can't, then I'll I'll think about ideas for a tinfoil hat emote. Choosy pit, maybe? Like that, but with fig. Wait, hold on. What is this one? Oh, <laughs> holding a knife. That's adorable. I like it. Yes, yes. Fig holding a knife would be very cute. Tinfoil would be great. <laughs> Can you join me now? Whatever the reason, I'm glad I could help. Once you deliver that data, I could use you on the Normandy. I promised to see this mission through. I did. I can leave with you and send the data to the fleet. She's coming and with if us! If the admirals have a problem with it, they can go to hell. I just watched the rest of my team die. Yeah, so I guess Maybe the best the No, he's alive! Rieger, you made it. He Your made it! As good as you said. Damn Colossus never stood a chance. Do you need transportation? Ties with me now. If need be, the Normandy can get you out of here, Rieger. 
Well, the Geth didn't damage our ship. As long as we get out of here before reinforcements show up, we'll be fine. Actually, I won't be going with you. I'm joining Commander Shepard. I'll pass the data to the Admiralty board and let him I know can't believe he happened. made it. I thought He's for sure. Now, Shepard. Keep her safe. They gave me plus 15 renegade points. I thought for sure he was going to die. Oh my goodness. I can't believe he survived. Been him all along. All right. Uh, recruit a tally for the team. Though loyal to Shepard, Tally's antagonism towards Cerberus necessitates observation. Also sending recon units to examine Geth activities in case activities on Haystrom provoke action. Choosy seven, choosy jam, choosy act, choose a little www. There is no sub March. Okay, Sam, thank you so much for the seven month resub, seven months in a row. Thank you so much, Sam. I really appreciate it. Welcome back for another month. How are you doing? It's so good to see you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, we just recruited Tally. Very good. And we got a new submachine gun, and we got uh, auto or. Assault rifle damage upgrade and heavy pistol damage upgrade and lots of money and some iridium. Nice, nice mission. Just wait for paper. <laughs> no. Cerberus saw footage of you in action, Talizora. We're looking forward to having you on the team. Your engineering expertise will really benefit the mission. I don't know who you are, but Cerberus threatened the security of the migrant fleet. Don't make nice. I agree completely. We need to cooperate. You don't have to like them, Tally, but we're on the same side this time. I assumed that you were undercover, Shepard. Maybe even planning uh -oh. to blow Cerberus up. If that's the case, I'll loan you a grenade. Otherwise, I'm here for you, not for them. Feel free to sell the ship good enough for me. That's all I'm asking, Tally. Remember, Shepard, these people thought enslaving Thorian creepers and Rachni was a good idea. I'll be in engineering. <laughs> don't forget to introduce yourself to Edie. The ship's new artificial intelligence. No, we hate Edie. <laughs> Tally's like, no, don't think so. There we go. Thank you for the bit. No, not paper. No, there's no such thing. No, no, no. It's very creative, but no. All right, we got two more dossiers to do. Um, actually, let's go look at our upgrades. I don't think I have the materials, but maybe I do. Oh, I do. Oops. AP heavy pistol. Squad bonus plus 50% heavy pistol damage against armor. That is good. Okay. Biotic damage increase? Yes. Oh, we don't have enough for biotic duration. We need more element zero. Feed the fish! You all have not been reminding me to feed the fish at all. You want my fish to die, don't you? Do I hope you are too and shout to everyone in chat? Oh, thank you, Sam. Tally's so cool, right? All right, fish! Those fish are goners? No, no, I will not let these fish die, okay? If these fish die, I die. Ain't no way. All right, hear me? Yeah, me still hanging out. I think we're good here. Um, we could go talk to Tally. <gasps> Thank you for the hydrate, Virgil. Everybody, hydrate. If fish die, we lose our endorphins, and we will all be sad. <laughs> Boo! That was a good one. That was a good one. All right, she said she was gonna be in engineering, which I assume is, oh, over here, okay. Shepard, what can I do for you? <gasps> Upgrades. Is the new Normandy giving you any trouble? Please, Shepard, I'm a quarian. Give me a chunk of scrap metal, a circuit board, and some element zero, and I'll have it making precision jumps. I was worried about working with Cerberus engineers, but they know what they're doing, and they've been very polite. Oh, good. Can you do anything to give the Normandy an edge over a collector ship? Definitely. With the right supplies, I can fortify our shields. Nice! The collectors cut through the Normandy's barriers immediately last time. My upgrades might give us a better chance. Nice. 
Ooh, I can afford it. Oh, for palladium, perfect. Shepard, what can I do for you? How's the Normandy running? Say what you will about Cerberus. They know how to build ships. The Normandy's running even better than before. Nice. I don't know if it can stand up to a collector attack, though. I'm researching some ideas that might help. Have you got time to talk? Oh, she wants to chat with us! We didn't really have time to chat while taking out Geth on Haystrom, did we? I can't believe so many people died. Thank you again for getting Rieger out alive. No problem. All for data about stars blowing up. I hope the Admiralty Board gets some use out of it. How is Rieger? Have you heard any word about Cal Rieger? Did he survive his injuries? He sent me a message. Oh, good. He like made it. A full recovery. Any time you get a suit puncture, it's a matter of luck. Rieger got out with a relatively minor infection. Tell me about the fleet's admiralty board. It's one of two major political powers among my people. The admirals make decisions related to defense or needing immediate action. They also handle major criminal charges, like treason. The other political power is the Conclave, a group of representatives from each ship. They make most of our laws and fleet decisions. Any news yet on the data you sent? I'm not likely to hear anything for a while. Or on an unsecured channel, for that matter. Mm. <clears throat> Need more coffee? Bestie! <laughs> I, don't, I feel like Morden's bestie, but Tally, Tally's up there, too. Having any trouble settling back in on the Normandy? I like the quiet. I miss the old faces, Aww. though. Presley. Engineer Adams. Presley didn't them. make it. It doesn't seem right having Cerberus in charge of this ship. Are you sure working for them is the right thing to do? Why do you hate Cerberus? I'm the one in charge. I don't trust them. I don't have a choice. They're on our side. I don't like working with them any more than you do, but we need them. I know. Just watch yourself. You're their best weapon right now. But as soon as you no longer serve their needs, be ready oh, I'm ready. I'm ready. And now, I should get back to work. Thanks for coming by. They're all dead, okay? If they try to turn on me, they're all dead. Jenkins, I know. Poor Jenkins. Alright, we got the shield for the ship. That's you good. Reinforcements really threw off the gravimetric profile. But engines are good to go. I rebalanced the Gilborn coefficients and adjusted the anterior intakes on the second. Okay, let's go back up. And then let's go do the other two dossiers. Oh, I got a message, though. Progia facility update from Cerberus Intel. Commander Shepard, contacting you per elusive man's instructions. He believed you would want to know that he had ordered Subject Zero's project shut down before the riot broke out. Cerberus personnel arrived to find all guards dead, along with most of the subjects. Any surviving children were treated for injuries given mild amnesic treatments and delivered to alliance facilities as survivors of slaver attacks a few surviving doctors were forcibly retired for their role in the project per your report the facility on progia has been destroyed oh. all right transfer requests approved from admiralty board migrant fleet commander shepherd pertali pertali's request included with her data delivery from haystrom the Admiralty Board has approved her transfer to your command. She has been informed that additional duties to the migrant fleet may still be necessary on occasion, but has been given extended leeway to determine when her mission with you is considered complete. This choice was hers, but your role as de facto captain during her pilgrimage may have caused her to be more susceptible to your requests. The Admiralty Board trusts that you will treat your new crew member with the respect due an honored member of the fleet. Should any harm come to her due to negligence on your part, this board will take severe and appropriate action. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> we'll be safe. Choosing probably a good animated emote idea. Yes, yes. I need to check with the new artists if uh, they do animated emotes too. Because not all of them do, but I'll have to check with them. No harm come to Tali under our watch. I wouldn't dare. Okay, let's go find the other, the other two recruits. Oh, we gotta get out of here first. Um, here.
Fuel Depot, give me all of the probes. Back to Ilium. Okay. We came here last stream for Miranda's loyalty quest. Um, and we explored a bit, but yeah, that was about it. All right, here, who do we want to bring here? I feel like I haven't brought Kasumi recently. So let's bring Kasumi. Mm. I want to bring Kasumi and Grunt, I think. I love Grunt. He's such a solid team member. We need Gorbamote with a hood and everything. <laughs> no Gorbamote. You love the essaying just to finish reading it all? What is Gorb? Gorb is one of the bosses in um, Hollow Knight. Yeah, <laughs> that's all I'll say. All right, three points now. Tactical cloak, AI hacking, armor piercing ammo. Okay, yeah, let's do armor piercing ammo. Two points here. No, we can save up. Let's save up for like incendiary ammo or something. Master, thief, flashbang. Okay. We'll stick with what we have. So let's see, we have two dossiers here, the Justicar and the Assassin. This one's talk to tracking officer Dara in the transportation hub. And this one's talk to Serena in the cargo transfer level downstairs. Whoever we find first is whose mission we're gonna do. I don't recognize either of those names. I'm sure I met them last time, but I don't. I, there were so many people here. Uh oh. Okay, one of them said downstairs. I don't know. Oh, maybe we should do some shopping. Did I not buy anything here? Followed by a freeze as new colony plants dry up. Just watch. So, so. Oh, she's back. Wait. Okay, so we sat down with her and she was like, I got my eye on this bartender over here. And then she like very sus got up and left all of a sudden. But then we went and told the bartender like, hey, look out. This woman's keeping her eye on you. <laughs> he totally gave her up. Uh, Gorb is love, Gorb is everything. I literally have a Gorb portrait in your room. It's true, it's true. Hi, Adrian. Awkward, I know. Hi, Growl. Hit us with the bird fact. How are you doing, friend? It's so good to see you. Oh, you haven't played Hollow Knight. Have you thought about it, Dan? It's so good. It's one of my favorite games ever. Any Gorb will do. We're desperate. Hail Gorb, full of grace. Uh huh, uh huh. Today's bird fact Camp Robbers, Clarks, Nutcrackers, and Canada Jays share another name, Camp Robber. Both birds are friendly and will approach camps and find food, grab it, and fly away. They're even known to land on an outstretched hand, offering peanuts. Oh, adorable. Thank you, Growl. Robbers. Hollow Knight's an amazing game that does not have a sequel. <laughs> sequel TBD. TBA? TBR? TB released? I don't know, but. There's some wild speculations about a, a sequel out there. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna take a quick break. Uh, okay, let's get back to Ilium. <gasps> let's talk to her. Let's see what she has to say. Damn it, Shepard! I trusted oh. you. I trusted you, and you screwed me over. Lady, that's your fault for trusting us. Do we look trustworthy? Do I look trustworthy? Look at my face. <laughs> Do I look like someone you should trust? <laughs> Do you have anything flashier? I want oh wait, no, no, no. Sense. I gotta see what this is. We have money room. again, so we can buy stuff. We don't you. need um, more time for bypass. We can do that just fine. Oh, right. It's just this uh, armor, which I didn't really like anyway, so I don't want that. Someone named Dara. Someone with a name that starts with an S. <clears throat>
I also kept getting lost around here. I don't know where to go. Oh, the bachelor party. That was hilarious. If you're hurting for things to do, maybe after work we could catch a vid or something. I can taste hate in the air, but there's no fighting. It's like, like they don't want to. Is that right? Because it seems stupid. Rules and words to hide how they hide. Okay, fighting so it's not simple. here. Kill the guy aiming at you. Here, there's no way to tell. Stupid. <laughs> I trusted you and you screwed me over. Fancy like 420. Yep, yeah, that one is a fancy number. I feel like telling her say so you want me to do all the work is like I did on Novaria while you lounge away drinking yourself to death. No thanks. Yep. <laughs> Anyway, we can rationalize our behavior. I'm all for. Two sus time to vote you off the space station. Yep. <laughs> if they were smart, they they would all vote me off first. Salarian. I feel like there's no one here either. Um, uh, maybe. Oh, oh, oh! We found one. Here we go. Serena, who wants to know? Someone with questions, show some respect. Someone who can make your life a living hell. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> Liara Tassoni said you'd have information on Thane Krios. Am I wasting my time? Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Where is he? So you know he's an assassin. Then talk fast. I just need to talk to him. Dangerous man to chat with. Your call, though. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. I thought that was just a rumor. Well, you know what she's capable of then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. She uses it to keep her friends in check and her enemies dead. Wow. <laughs> you remember Nasada? No, I don't. I don't remember. Uh, you forgot this is in the conversation. I don't remember who that was. I don't remember a mission where I went to kill someone's sister. Who was a slaver. Yeah, I don't think I remember. So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1. Dantius Towers. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. Do you have access? Thanks for the info. It doesn't sound like Nasana is just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. We love I fighting. I win, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. Um... Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. If he takes down Nasana, I don't care why he does it. You're just offering your help. No strings attached? You're going to look for Thane. Nasana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. I think we're ready. She was in the bar across from the embassies in Mass Effect 1.
You meet her in the diplomatic lounge and she tells you her sister was on a freighter that was raided by some pirates. She said her sister was taken captive after you blasted through the pirate beast. You found out she was the sleever captain. I think I vaguely remember that. Man, there were so many missions. I think I vaguely remember that one. Yeah, that one definitely doesn't stand out in my head, though. All right, we're Let's ready. Go, then. Good. I'm tired of this crap. <laughs> we'll go tonight as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. Okay. Hi, Master Chief. I'm good. How are you doing? It's good to see you. Hope we're having a good Tuesday. Oh, we can repick our squad. I had Kasumi and Garrus? Is that who I had? Oh, I could bring Tali. Maybe we should bring Tali. She's got combat drone, AI hacking, energy drain. Okay. Um, let's try to bring Tali. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> I'm worried because, well, I guess we can level her up quite a bit here, but I haven't tried her out in this game, so we'll have to see. Through. I'm gonna save this for th for overload once we get four points. All right, she's got 23 points for us to spend. Command your very own battle drone. Oh my goodness, she can have a little pet combat drone. Keep it flying longer, make it more durable, increase the frequency of its attacks. And she's got AI hacking as well. I don't know if I love AI hacking. Mostly because I don't know exactly what we can hack. It says synthetic enemies, but sometimes I feel like it doesn't work. Oh, I didn't mean to upgrade this all to three. Oh, it's fine. Okay, we can fully upgrade this, which me would mean attack drone. Upgrades combat drones as electric shock damages, uh, targets health armor and biotic barriers. Limit is one active drone at a time. Or explosive drone. When combat drone is destroyed, it pulses energy, inflicting high damage on all enemies. I'm going to go with the uh, attack drone, I think. AI hacking, if we go all the way, would be improved AI hacking greatly increases the duration of AI hacking. Oh, I can I go? Oh, I can take this all the way. Okay. Um, and the strength of the shield given to the hacked target. Area hacking gives AI hacking a wider effect so multiple synthetics can be hacked at once. I think we'll just go with one. The one. Um, so improved AI hacking. I maybe should have leveled up uh, Cory and Mechanist, though. Mechanist? Machinist? Okay. Mm, I kind of want to give him this one. Hand cannon. Okay. You can hack Geth, attack drone easily. Maybe I should start hacking the drones. Who said that couldn't have been choose? Drink forever until the day I die. Towers are heavily guarded, and you'll find more resistance closer to the penthouse. So this assassin, you planning to stop him? I'm just here to make sure he survives. Hmm. I think we're trying to recruit the assassin. Siggy hoarder. Uh oh. There they are, the Dantius towers. You'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the penthouse. Her mercs will fight you every step, but it's your best chance. Let's just fly up. We'll see. We might find him before it goes that far. Maybe. At least you'll know where he's headed. Tower or take us in? Any last minute tips about the towers? The Eclipse mercs will be well fortified by now, and they won't want to disappoint Nasana. There's no automated defenses or traps. Just focus on anything moving. All right, take All us right. in. Let's do this. Hold on. Don't linger too long. Faith me confirmed. <laughs> Good luck, Shepard. I don't think I said that, but I could have said that, like, sarcastically. Uh-oh. Oh, no! <gasps> oh, the doggos. Yikes. This 
Okay, I got the particle beam. For some reason. What is this thing? What is this glowing purple orb? Maybe it's friendly? Oh, it's gone. Okay. Music track for this mission is the longest in the trilogy? Fun little detail? Interesting. Solarian worker. He's still alive. Oh, that was Tally's attack drone. Oh. I can't feel my legs. My chest is killing me. I'm sorry what happened. You're lucky. Just be glad you're still breathing. What happened? We're just night workers. Nasana sent them after us. She sent the mechs to round us up, but we didn't hear. They just started shooting. Without warning? I'm looking I'm looking for a cool story, bro, but I'm looking for someone. Hi, <laughs> welcome back, one for the money. You got a sub, let's go. Good orb. Someone's here to kill Nasana. I need to find him. I haven't seen anyone. But that explains. The merc said there was no time. Nasana wanted us out of the way. Immediately. Then <coughs> the dogs. The dogs. He's oh not no. Going to make it if we don't help him. Oh no. Please, please help me. My chest is. Hang on, we're done here. I'm sorry. <gasps> That's so mean. I can't say that. I have to say I'm sorry. I can't help him, but I can't say that. That's so mean. Help him choose. I'm gonna cry. <gasps> oh no, the Salarians are just so like. They remind me of like old people, you know. Do it now. Give him some cigs to help his cough juice. <laughs> Sorry. There's nothing I can do for you. Oh, we're the, the worst. Help them. I'll do what I can. Oh no. I only get two renegade points for that. That is BS. That was BS. I got 15 renegade points for allowing uh re. Rieger? Is that his name? Rieger to help us? And he still made it out alive! What in the world? Oh, no, the doggos. Is it basically sci-fi Baldi's 3? It's not quite Baldi's 3 because it's not turn-based combat. But it is a very story-rich game where your actions um, have a big effect on the story, how the story plays out. Um, and it's really central around the characters. So in that in that sense, it's a lot like Baldi's, yeah. Wow, this sniper rifle is really strong against the doggos. Oh, there's more. Combat throws away. Where'd they go? Okay. I think you're a baddie. I don't know. I'm just going to shoot everyone. Ooh, there's more. Ooh, the doggo. Someone is screaming. Oh, there's still more. Dude, is this just an endlessly respawning mission again? Combat drone ready. I think it might be. Okay, let's go this way. No, are we done? <laughs> of course, when I'm like, it's endlessly respawning, we get them all. Oh, there's nothing in there. <clears throat> Where's the justice? Helpless Solar, and we're done. That's so mean. Most the recruitment missions have unique tracks usually named after whoever you're recruiting. The one here is Thane, because Thane. <laughs> it's like nine minutes long. That is a very long, very long song. 
I guess it's all about the context, right? Is it is it really good where like nine minutes is justified? Like is it a Taylor Swift all too well 10 minute version? If so, I can get down with that. Oh my God, this dog. I hack you. <gasps> no, not the dog fight. Oh no, the doggos are fighting. One less to worry about. Good? No, not good. Still more. I got you. Oh, more. Okay. So far, so good. You're here for OP shooting. There's decent shooting. I don't know if I'd call it OP. <laughs> Hi, MK. How are you doing? Better late than never. It's good to see you. Hope you're having a good Tuesday. Hello, hello. Been practicing the aim. Yeah, we're getting pretty good at the sniper rifle. This is like my main though. <laughs> so the other guns are not so good. Hey, I think you went in here. Uh oh. We'll go get him. You go. <laughs> you go. Uh oh. It sounded bad. Oh no! Oh, no, no. Oh, no. Okay. To worry about. okay. Oh my god, this son of a gun! I think we got them all. Oh, just kidding, there's more. Of course there's more! Oh, there's a lot more! Alright, what are we gonna do here? Send the drone in! Oh, it's out here. Oh, there's a door. Oh, that's where we're going. You need a blast. Concussive shot ready. Oh, there's there's multiples. Hold on. All right, I gotta be careful. Nice. You know, they want me to go that way. What's behind this door? Hold on. <clears throat> Drones are great because they take the attention of the enemy off of you. Yes. Oh, it's extra passage? I don't know. Oh! <gasps> you stinky! Oh my goodness, someone's got- Oh no, someone's got- No, not this one, nope. <laughs> I can't see. I can't see. I want to go back. Let me go back. <laughs> Alright, got him that time. Yeesh! What is this? What is this? <laughs> I just heard this little robot next to me, and I was like, wait, I don't think that's Tali or Garrus. Uh oh. Well, how do I keep missing this one? The drone got him. Okay, okay, okay. Got you. I don't know, maybe I need to go up so they'll stop advancing? I don't know. I can now I can't tell if things are like endlessly spawning or if there's just a lot of enemies, you know? 
Oh, totally missed. Oh my god, they're fast. Okay, someone's getting him. Uh-oh. Just kidding, it was me. Let's kick some ass. Ah. Ah. Nice shooting. Alright, I gotta get more ammo. Good though. Okay. <clears throat> Thane track's pretty good. Chill and mysterious vibe to it. Nice. Oh, we got a new sniper rifle. No way. How exciting. I hope it's a good one. <clears throat> Savage, what a killer. No, what do you mean? I'm the nicest person in space. It's like totally my reputation. Your new gun and it's a sniper rifle. I'm so excited. My goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's fine. They're trying to make the bypass trickier because I didn't invest in the double time. Please, don't kill us. We'll go, we'll go. Hey, look, they're not Eclipse. You're here to help us. Yes, right? sort of no, uh-oh. No. Oh, God. <laughs> These are the friends we're supposed to help. Oh, no. I'm looking for someone and you're not him. But is it safe to come out? Seen anyone suspicious who isn't a merc? Well, whoever sealed us in here. When he found us, I thought we were dead, but he just closed the door and locked us in. Locked you in? Sounds like our assassin was trying to keep them safe. Helping. Assassin? Here for Nasana, I bet. She's got it coming. You treat people like this, it always comes back to bite you in the ass. I need to get to Nasana's penthouse. What's the quickest way? Cargo elevator is the only way up right now. They're still working up top. Watch your step. Some of the walls aren't in, and it's a long way down. Oh, jeez. Cold, too. I hate working up there. Nasana's not exactly your favorite person? She's a hard woman to work for. That's an understatement. She works as long hours, no overtime, and this is what you get in payment. She's unpleasant, to say the least. <laughs> Sounds miserable or whiners. <laughs> no. Why are they making us so mean? It does sound miserable. I don't think they're whining, but I have to pick this. Your sniper rifle amazing right now. The upgrade to the first one that we had, like the super strong one that said that it'll blow a human's arm off. And then y'all were like, no, choose. You're built different. And I was like, okay. <laughs> Whiners! Oh no. If you don't like the work, just leave. Easier said than done. What's stopping you? Our contract. We're stuck until the job's done. Quitting for any reason can be hazardous to your health. We hear that anyone who leaves early tends to disappear. Probably just a rumor. Yikes! But who wants to find out for sure? Did you see the one who locked you in? Do you know where he might have gone? He's no Solarian, I can tell you that. But I've no idea where he went. Sorry. If he's after Nasana, he'll be heading to the upper levels. How many workers were in the tower? Are there many more of you? Not alive. We were lucky. Well, some got out before the dogs were sent in. Maybe a few are hiding somewhere. Okay. I wouldn't stay here too long. It should be safe down on the lower floors. I was just thinking the same thing. Let's go, everybody! Thank you. And tell your assassin to aim for her head. Because she doesn't have a heart. Get moving! Jeez! <laughs> Okay. 
Nice, the bunnies. Whiny little subordinates. <laughs> That's so mean. Poor Solarians are treated so badly in here. I know. Perhaps we should find some Oh my god, they think someone's in there. Have a pleasant day. Get in the cover, oh y'all! Lost shields. Already lost shields. Oh, I have the new sniper rifle. Here we go. Oh, it's like a plasma sniper rifle. Coming in close. All right, what do we do? Incinerate. Coming at us. Yikes. All right. I. Oh my God, the Krogan! <laughs> These dudes are the. Oh my God. Hello? Hello? Are you still alive? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sir? Sir? <laughs> Who are you shooting at? Oh my god, oh my god. Yeesh! Everything's fine. Everything is fine. I don't know how I feel about this uh, sniper rifle. I think I like my other one better. Okay, so they said the elevator is the only way to get upstairs. I'm gonna see what's over here real quick. I think this is where we came from. Okay, I guess we're going upstairs. What is that username? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, let's go. Ooh. The sniper rocks actually maybe less damage is a bigger clip and fires crazy faster sniper. I was gonna say it feels really good, but the damage don't worry. my team's always ready to go. I don't know where he is. Not yet. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. Uh oh. You should worry. We don't need any reinforcements. <laughs> Turn around very slowly. I'm looking for Thane. I need answers. Tell me where the assassin is and I might let you live. If I knew that, I wouldn't be wasting my time talking to you. You're not one of Nasana's mercs. Who are you? I've got an offer. I'll ask you again. Listen carefully. You got two ways down. Express or coach. <laughs> Your choice. Look, pal. Even if I knew where he was, I wouldn't tell you. Not the answer I was looking uh -oh. for. Uh-oh. I've got nothing more to say to you. If you shoot me- Wow! How about goodbye? Shoved him out the Harsh. window! Oh my I'm god! <laughs> okay. That's a long way down. Holy. Ruthless. <laughs> <laughs> Story just holds a list of genetic information for the Curosa family. Oh man. <laughs> One of the best parts of the mission for a renegade player. I had a feeling they were gonna give me a renegade quick time event. We've got reports of him on multiple levels. We think he's traveling through the ducts. I'm not paying you to think. Oh, dang. <laughs> Ragdoll! Hacking the mech! Okay, that mech's on our side. Dang. <laughs> this gun is fun. I just wish it was a little bit more damage, you know? <clears throat> okay. Careful. 
Mink was no longer on our side. Oh, that's the comm terminal? Okay. <laughs> oh, please. Are you guys all right in here? Get oh, back. more Solarians. Get back. I'll shoot. Relax. Don't do anything you'll regret. <laughs> I don't want to hurt you. But I will. Oh no! I'm pushing everyone. I hardly felt a thing. Tell on. I'm sorry. Slow and easy. He's my brother. <gasps> I just want to see if he's all right. Are you the ones who shot the Merc? I don't think so. No, not that one. I was just learn who and talk to you on your way to where Serena was. <laughs> oh no. I've shot a lot of mercs today, but I can't take credit for him. Then who did? You tell me. What happened? The merc found us and shouted at us to move. We, we panicked, and he shouted more. I thought he was going to kill us, then his head just exploded. Telen picked up the merc's gun, but we were too afraid to leave. Then you showed up. A perfect headshot, with no collateral mm. damage. Very impressive. How safe is that bridge out there? The bridge is stable, but the wind's your real problem. If it doesn't throw you off, the mercs will definitely try. There's a lot of them out there. I'm looking for someone. Probably the guy who killed this merc. Talon thought he saw someone following us, but he's been a bit... on edge. I haven't seen anyone but the mercs. Is the bridge the only way to the penthouse and the other tower? From here, yeah. It won't be easy. Mercs are patrolling the other side. Whatever Nasana's hiding from must be pretty scary. There are still mercs up here. You should get to the lower levels. I thought we killed them all. No need to convince me. Tell him. Come on, get him. Okay, up. he's okay. Can we go home now? Oh! Yeah, we're getting out of here. Thank you. So sad. It seems so unnecessary. I'm the worst. Oh my god. Renegade bar going way up. The poor Solarians, they feel so bad. Give me something! Okay. <clears throat> you get a punch, and you get a punch. Okay, I think that's where we came from, so we want to go this way. Right, the comm terminal. It's about time! <laughs> What's going on down there? I'm afraid your men aren't able to respond, Nasana. Damn it! Uh-oh, she Angie! We are monster! Yep, I am monster. Oh, here we go. Um, it's AI hack you. Because of shock, Fred. I'll tear you apart. All right, your turn. Oh. <laughs> oh god. These poor that battle drone is wrecking them. These poor things. <laughs> One down. Oh god. Oh no! Why do I feel bad for them? <laughs> Alright, this way.
There's something here. Oh, med kit. Ooh, element zero. Yes. All right, I'll stick with the I'll stick with the sniper for now. See if it gets better. The capacity is really nice. Okay. Who? Who? Yikes. I don't even know. Uh, yeah, send the drone. Send the drones. This should soften them up. This should punch through their armor. Get him! Then stay down. Oh my god, B! <laughs> Hello. I'm so focused on this mission right now. Oh my god, B, how are you doing? Hello, hello. Also with the name change. Hi. How's it going, B? So good to see you. Welcome in, Raiders. Hello, 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 everyone. Thank you for the raid. How are you doing? How was your stream? What were you up to today? I know you've been playing uh, Star Wars, one of the Star Wars games recently. Um, but what were you doing today? And how was your stream? Welcome in, guys. Hello. Hi, Marianne. Good to see you, too. Hi, members. Hi, everyone. How's it going? Hello, hello. Thank you for the shout out. Everyone, please go follow B, aka Sailor. She is the sweetest, most incredible person ever. So it would mean a lot to me if you go show her some love. Oh, some Tomb Raider rides. Nice. Did some just chatting, hanging out. Very, very nice. I hope it was wonderful. The best game series ever. Oh my god. I am loving this series, Sailor. I didn't think I would, but I am very much enjoying this game. So we finished Mass Effect 1, and now we're like some part through Mass Effect 2. Um, and we are on veteran difficulty, playing as an infiltrator class. And I am going like full renegade, and <laughs> it's been really hard today. Um, and we're trying to get in Garrus's pants, okay? But he's too busy calibrating. But how are you guys? Thank you for all the follows. I really appreciate it. So glad you're joining me too. Me too. I'm really enjoying it. Hi, John Kiwi. Welcome in. Hi, Aimless. Hi, Helix. Welcome in, guys. Hi, Nikos. Infiltrator, yeah. <laughs> we played in, um, we played as a Vanguard class in Mass Effect 1, but I ended up using the sniper rifle the whole time. And people were like, yeah, you should have picked Infiltrator. So I switched to Infiltrator for Mass Effect 2. And I didn't romance anyone in Mass Effect 1. I feel like the only person who hit on us was Liara. And I didn't want to... I mean, we mind melded a couple times, but I was like, okay, that's enough. I was waiting for Kaiden to hit on us and he never did. So, also he's garbage now, we hate him. <laughs> and what else did we do? We did a Renegade playthrough of Mass Effect 1 as well. Um, we picked Kaiden over Ashley. We let the council die. Um, we also may or may not have killed the Rachni Queen. It was a bloodbath. Uh, also may or may not have killed all the colonists on Pharaohs. <laughs> Gotta calibrate the pants. Oh my god. I like I can't I can't with Garrus, okay? Every time we go talk to Garrus, he start drooling and then he's always like mm, I, gotta, I gotta calibrate or oh I gotta do some more research. Garrus <laughs> Liara's your blue waifu. Oh my god. She she is pretty cool, yeah. But I was like, I don't know, I don't know. We just need romance, okay, yes, exactly, kind of. <laughs> he was cool until we met him again in Mass Effect 2 and we were like, hey, come join us, come join our squad. And he was like, uh, no, I'm an Alliance bro and I will never join Cerberus and I don't care if you're part of Cerberus, I'm not joining. And I was like, well, you're dead to me. Mm -hmm. Too evil to love, no, I love Garrus, I do. He's still alive, he is still alive, yep. Heck, the council. You killed the council even on your Paragon run. People were saying that, it's hilarious. The best part of Mass Effect 1 is definitely disconnecting as many times as you can with the council. The mandibles. Oh, John Kiwi, thank you so much for gifting a sub to be. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's really nice. We're trying to kiss Garrus right now. He's researching if his pee-pee is human compatible. 
Thank you, Rip Penguin. Precisely. Take a hint, Garrus, right? Goodness. <laughs> Hi, Robin. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good Tuesday. Thank you guys so much, though, for the raid. I really appreciate it. If you need to go take care of yourself, B, please, please do. Um, if you're new here, if you don't know me, my name is Choose. We are doing a first playthrough of Mass Effect 2 right now. I'm currently on the mission to recruit the assassin um, on Ilium. And I have Tali with me. We just recruited her and Garrus because I'm trying to make him love me. Um, and uh, really enjoying the game. Yeah, my first experience with Mass Effect, and it's been so much fun. Really, really enjoying it. Mm -hmm. We typically do a variety here. I lean more towards the Souls-like games. Uh, big fan of those, so very excited for the Elden Ring DLC coming out soon. And what we're going to play after this is most likely going to be Dragon's Dogma 2. Yeah, excited about that one too. And then hopefully we'll eventually get to Mass Effect 3. Yeah. Love me now, Garrus. He's not going to, sadly. Maybe Garrus saw Breaking Dawn Part 1 doesn't want a repeat of the... The what debacle? I have not seen Breaking Dawn Human. I cannot relate. R1 Gamer, not a big deal. Y'all are too nice. Okay. I don't remember where we left off before we hit pause, but there's a lot of chaos happening, I think. Yup. Oh, we just got this new sniper rifle too. I've been meaning the sniper rifle again in Mass Effect 2. We just got a new one. It's like a plasma sniper rifle. The damage is kind of low, but it's got really good capacity and uh, firing speed. So we're going to take her for a run. See how she does. But I was using the one that's super strong and super slow before. Uh, and I love that one. I love the guns that fire like really really high damage like where you can one shot people feels nice and i'm also terrible at this hacking okay <laughs> i'm better at the i'm better at the connect the dots game i'm pretty bad at the hacking though Gotta research the amino acids. Maybe Garrus saw Breaking Dawn. One shot, so a strength-based weapon. <laughs> for some reason, for whatever reason, it doesn't work that way in Souls-like games. It works that way in like all other games, but not Souls-like games. I need the speed. <laughs> we need the Dexy speed. All right, here we go. All right, send in the drones. Oh my goodness, these guys are... These guys hit hard! Firing a high impact shot. What weapons do these guys have? <laughs> Actually insane. Hit like a tank, exactly. I've never heard her watch Twilight, now we know her childhood was sad. I actually watched one of the Twilight movies. I couldn't tell you which one. I think maybe the first one. Was that Breaking Dawn? Maybe I lied. <laughs> I was forced against my will to go watch it. Oh, no. Go get them, Topeka. Good, good. That, uh, that attack drone is actually really good. Really, really good. <laughs> Talia might become a main staple of our squad. When I read the description, I was like, there's no way this thing's gonna be good, but it's actually really good. Just having them focus their attention on, like, not us is really helpful. Ooh. Oh my god, everyone down! Everyone got- oh my goodness. Rockets to the face. <gasps> I can't get them from- oh no. I cannot get them from here. We gotta run. We just gotta run. Oh, this is bad. Okay, so- uh, no drone. Okay, that's fine. Uh... This is not good. Not ideal. 
Oh, Tally's down, that's why. What the hell am I paying you for? Oh my goodness gracious! Get him! Well, they're just gonna hide up there. Let me oh no, you can't hit these guys. Hold on. Okay. Okay, we're good. Whew. I can't even see these guys. It's so dark. There they are. We get them. There's still one more. Tear you apart. You're toast. I'm sending in reinforcements. Well, you're toast. No, 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 no reinforcements. No, <gasps> don't you run. Oh my goodness, is everyone down again? Down. What? Damn it. Okay, Garrus is down. Oh no. Garrus? Okay, okay. <laughs> Send in the drone. They're all yours. Nice. This drone is great. Firing oh. eye impact shot. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Focus fire on my target. Okay. Headshots for days. Oh no. Gamble in case the stars are still aligned. 333. Good call. Good luck, Virgil. Three's my favorite number. 806. So close, Virgil, but unlucky. Anybody read a bunch of Anne Rice way back? No. I don't even know who that is. Your mate was pretty close to dragging you to the Elden Ring. It got rough. Oh no. Elden Ring's a tough, tough game, but it's so good. Bonkman falling asleep. Wake up, Dan. Glad you've recovered. <laughs> Oh no, one away. Same thing, yep. Mm -hmm. Alright. Shepard, but you're dead. I got better. And now <laughs> you're here to kill me. Interesting idea. I'm not here to kill you. Is that what you think? Maybe I just missed you. Screw you, Shepard. Charming as ever. I'm sure you find this all very ironic. First you take care of my sister, and now you're here for me. Well, you made it this far. Now what? You still think it's me? You're delusional. It's not what you think. No, we're definitely going with your Delulu. I wouldn't waste time hunting you down, Nasana. What do you call this? You've practically destroyed my towers. I wasn't looking for you. What the hell are you talking about? Is it credits? Is that what you want? Just tell me your price. We can make this problem go away. How much do you have? No, we can't. Well, I kind of do want the money. Because <laughs> then we could buy more fish, right? I think we have to say no, we can't, though. I don't think she's actually going to give us money, even if we said how much do you have. <clears throat> to the Elden Ring. Jolly cooperation on the brain, yes. I don't think I'm going to have time to play more tomorrow, but maybe this weekend? Maybe we'll find some time. Yashpar, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. We need more fish, okay? I may or may not have accidentally let some fish die. I didn't mean to. I thought I was feeding them enough, but I think I went too many missions back to back and then I forgot. We can buy more fish to replace the ones we constantly kill. I did buy some new fish, but I don't know where to find more fish. No more fish. They need mercy. No, no, Sundi. They're, they're very happy fish. <laughs> They're very well taken care of, okay? All the credits in the world won't make this problem go away, Nasana. Who the hell gave you the right to play God? I may not be perfect, but look at you. We both kill people for money. What's the difference? 
I met some of your workers. You'll never know. You are pathetic. Okay, this one's actually fun. Being, <laughs> being renegade here is actually kind of fun. You had some interview with a vampire? Oh, some of interview with the vampire. Okay. Big goodbye, we're fish. Uh, I do love me some fish. I might go to the aquarium this weekend. Oh, so cool. The aquarium's a really fun place. Hi, Toasty David. Welcome in. How are you doing? They need a loving and caring home. Leave them alone. The loving and caring home is in my tank in my bedroom. Zundi. <laughs> And also Heiston. Chonker fish. The fish I bought recently are very pretty. I like them. Nothing else Eldering could possibly stand for that a roommate would drag you to. Oh, oh, El like emergency room? <laughs> I thought we were talking about Elden Ring. <laughs> Maybe ER is an emergency room. Yep, definitely have jolly cooperation on the brain. <laughs> Looks so nice in the remake. Nice lighting. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna say you're pathetic. You brought this on yourself. I wouldn't stop it even if I could. What do you mean? Of course you can stop it. Just don't... What are they aiming at? Hello? What? I heard something. Oh. Damn it. Check the other entrances. It's the assassin, I bet. You stay put. When I'm finished dealing with this- What in the world? I am going to... Who? Ooh. This person looks real scary, I'm not gonna lie. Impressive. <laughs> you certainly know how to make an entrance. Hello? Can we talk? You ignoring me? Question mark. Hotty alert. Oh no, he's cool. <laughs> A leggy fish. Is that mind meld lady? No, no. Uh, Liara, we did meet her and she went off somewhere, but uh, no, <laughs> that was not her. What kind of fish is she? How did I lose three highs today? Oh my goodness. Cindy Harrod and Repulse, you actual riggers. What a rig. I just tore this place apart looking for you. The least you can do is look at I'm gonna have to give myself a loan at this Pray rate. The wicked must never be forsaken. Why? I see. Don't bother. Nasana and her men deserve what they got. Not for her. For me. The measure of an individual can be difficult to discern by actions alone. Take you, for instance. All this destruction, chaos. I was curious to see how far you'd go to find me. Well, here I am. You expected me, so I see. I do want to talk to you, but how did you know I was here? Gunfire and explosions. I prefer to work quietly. If I have to fight through guards, I've made a mistake. I rarely make mistakes. I like his voice acting. You disrupted my plan, but your distraction eventually proved valuable. B word, I want you on my team. I do though. <clears throat> uh, you love his design so much. Something about his voice, very cool. Very mysterious. Oh, chum. <laughs> Rip chum. I give you a loan for a modest interest. I'm giving out interest-free loans. What do you mean, human? Oh Lord, here we go. <laughs> voice is like Tennessee whiskey. Yep, yep. Let's cut to the chase. I need you for a mission. Indeed. You're familiar with the Collectors? By reputation. They're abducting entire human colonies. Freedom's progress was their handiwork. I see. We're going after them. Attacking the Collectors would require passing through the Omega-4 Relay. No ship has ever returned from doing so. We'll find a way that will change, so I've heard. They tell me it's a suicide mission. I intend to prove them wrong. A suicide mission? <laughs> yes, a suicide mission will do nicely. So, you coming? I'm dying. Oh. Low survival odds don't concern me. The abduction of your colonists does. Are you sick? I'm sorry, then let's go. You're worried about humans. 
You're dying. Are you contagious? How long do you have? If you're interested, we can discuss it on your ship. The problem isn't contagious, and it won't affect my work. I'm sorry, let's go. You're worried about humans? Not to look a gift assassin in the mouth, <laughs> but why are human colonists a concern to you? They are innocent, yes? Like all victims of the Collectors. The universe is a dark place. I'm trying to make it Aww. brighter before I die. Okay, I like this guy. Many innocents died today. I wasn't fast enough and they suffered. I must atone for that. I will work for you, Shepard. No charge. Okay, I like him. <laughs> we pay interest by our damaged pride. Oh, no, John. <laughs> Nothing. You can be throopy with Shepard and Gary. I would allow it. You think his voice sounds like he's talking through a slow burp? Oh no. Wow. <laughs> Looking gift assassins in the mouth from now on, right? Non-ruthless assassin, right? We love Thane. His eye his eyes are kind of weird. They they remind me of uh fish, oddly enough. <laughs> I will have your baby, Thane. I mean what? Recruited Thane for the team, but medically questionable unless mission is resolved quickly. Legal representatives dealing with public damage to Dantius Towers. We got this new sniper rifle. It's pretty good. We got submachine gun damage increase uh, for the squad. Plus 50%. That's really good. Got some money. He's got some element zero. Nice. Nice. Uh, Real Thiz, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in. <clears throat> I've heard impressive stories, Krios. Sounds like you'll be an asset to the team. That is, if you're comfortable having an assassin watch your back. <laughs> I've accepted Jacob. the contract. My arm is Shepard's. Uh-huh. Don't know about you, but I'm loyal to more than my next paycheck. What's the problem, Jacob? Enough, both of you? Watch yourself, Thane. God, I hate- I don't want to pick sides in these arguments. Can y'all just get along, please? Cause he a leggy fish, oh my god. That's pretty much what he is, huh? <laughs> Enough, both of you. Keep it civil, people. We've all got the same goal. Maintain the objective. Aye, aye, ma'am. Where shall I put my things? I'd prefer someplace dry if anything is available. Dry? The near the life support plant on the crew deck tends to be slightly more arid than the rest of the ship. Ah, an AI. My thanks. Still so can't trust Edie. He seems quite civil. Give him a chance. Keep an eye on him. We need all the help we can get. He's not what I expected in an assassin. He may surprise you. Yeah. And he may not. Jacob, you were so cool at the start of the game. What happened? He was so cool and now he is like Ashley. He's like the man version of Ashley. <sighs> Alright, Chom with the VIP gamble! Chum going with 420 blizzardy blab. Good luck, friend. 585. So close, but unlucky. That was actually pretty close. Still unlucky, sadly. <laughs> All right, what can we do? Submachine gun damage upgrade. Yes. Biotic duration. Ooh, we do have enough. We have just enough element zero. Let's do it. No new ship enhancements. Maybe we should talk to Thane. Commander, you received a new, new message messages. Terminal. It could happen to you. Oh, how do I? I need to set up like a spam blocker on my account from Elcos Mail Routing. Adrel lay in the ocean, dying from Capral Syndrome, and had a dream. In his dream, the Enkindlers came to him and charted the course of his life. The Drell saw the wakes and eddies and saw, that <laughs> and saw that sometimes the Enkindlers swam alongside him, limbs raking the water, while other times he was alone. The Drell saw that the times he was alone were the hardest times in his life. He asked the Enkindlers, why was this one abandoned? The Enkindlers answered, their light shining brightly. You were never abandoned. In those difficult times in your life, it was our bodies that bore you through the water. 
Someone's sending me religious email. Email spam. <laughs> the eddies. Not to look a gift assassin in the mouth, but uh, Shepard pulls out a light and tongue depressor. Can you go off for me? <laughs> Don't be doing Ashley like that. Leave my space racist alone. <laughs> I'm glad you understand, though. Close. So close. Next time, copium. Yep. All right. Uh... The Drell awoke and found his Keppel syndrome cured. If you follow the light of the Enkindlers, it can happen to you. Where the Enkindlers go, we shall follow. And where their light is the sun, we shall be the stars around them. Send this message to six beings of your acquaintance and your greatest wish shall come true. Gosh darn it. No. Get out of there. All right, we got to find Thane. My new bestie. <gasps> okay, you know what? Let's talk to Garrus. We haven't talked to Garrus in a while. Maybe he's ready. You know? Maybe he's finally ready. Do you need something? You mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all. Oh, no upgrades. We need to have the best equipment possible to take on the collectors. You have any leads I could chase down? My old contact network often located rare equipment for me. Would you like me to get in touch with them? Yes. Oh, yes or no? You can say no? Let's see what they've got. Oh, I can't afford it. I need iridium. 100% probe capacity and additional... <gasps> That's how you get more probes. Okay, that would be nice. Let me know if you want to pursue that. You mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all. There's something else I'd like to talk about. Ask. Okay, he doesn't have a lot of conversation points. Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. We haven't had a chance since I joined. When we met you, you said you were dying. Yes. I thought you'd want to know more. You don't have to worry about the rest of the crew. My illness is not communicable, even to other Drell. It's called Keprel Syndrome. What? Maybe we should send that email. <laughs> Maybe we maybe we should send it to six people. Nard check. I should add that line to a scroll in a D&D game at some point. Chain ladders ran rampant in your childhood, right, Waffle? Just unlocking all the childhood memories today. Hi, Clown Baby. How are you doing? No Nard questions, right? Can we help you seem calm about it? You don't act like a dying man. You have the advantage there, Shepard. You've already died. We did. Perhaps later you can give me some suggestions. I can do nothing to alter my fate. One advantage of my training is that I've always, to some degree, considered myself dead. Thank you for your concern. Trust me, this won't affect my performance. And we have a codex entry about his biology. I haven't looked at the codex at all. See under Let here. Oh my god, these all read to you. The f okay, no. <laughs> Not gonna look at all those. Yeah, happy Tuesday! Space Wiki is so fun. We looked at it a little bit in Mass Effect 1, but haven't looked at it at all in Mass Effect 2. Alright, let's go talk to Garrus. Do you guys think he's ready? If he's not ready now, I don't know if he ever will be. Please be ready, Garrus. Oh my god, please. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Definitely. No, he's not ready! Still, things were crazy for even considering blowing off steam, but I want to try it with you. I want a few Garrus! for us before we throw ourselves into hell for the good of the galaxy. <sighs> I want that too, Garrus. Glad to hear it. I'll I think I need some, to like uh, advance the next part of the main mission before he's ready. You know, I don't know what else to do. Okay, that sounded bad. Bye, Garrus, my love. <laughs> he's just shy. It's taken so long. He's not a scrub. No, I love Gears. He's nervous about his performance. Oh, Gears. <laughs> Stay strong, Gears. All right, we got to go back to 
Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I gotta go talk to Tali. Hold on, hold on. Leave! Kelly just said to go talk to Tali. Mm hmm. This way. Shepard, I'm glad you came by. I may need your help. I just received a message from the migrant fleet. The Admiralty Board has accused me of treason. No. Uh -oh. I'm scared, Shepard. They're crazy. What are the charges? So, what's the next step? Last, thank you for the hydrate. I appreciate it. Everyone, hydrate. He's playing hard to get, he really is. Tally, we love Tally. Is it because you're working with Cerberus? I'm not working with Cerberus. <laughs> I'm working with you. And I got leave to serve on the Normandy again. I have no idea what they're accusing me of. You'd think I would remember if I betrayed the fleet. They're crazy. Nobody who knows you could believe you'd betray your people, Tally. I don't know. They don't lay charges like this unless the evidence seems absolute. Mm. But thanks. I appreciate your faith in me, Shepard. What happens when a quarian is accused of treason? There's a hearing with members of the Admiralty Board acting as judges. My father is an admiral on the board. He'll have to recuse himself from judgment. I can't even imagine what he's thinking right now. The punishment for treason is exile. If they convict me, I can never go back. Dang. I'll help or we can't afford a delay. I'll help. Okay. Let's go find the flotilla. I was going to book passage on another ship. I didn't think there would be time for you to help. Anything for you, Thank bestie. You, Shepard. I'll program the Normandy with the flotilla's current location. The admirals will be waiting for us. All right, Timber Ghost, the VIP gamble going with 500. Good luck, friend. 485! Oh no, we're back to being close! Timber Ghost! <laughs> so close. So close, but unlucky. Oh my goodness. It was 500 the magic number. It is certain. It was so close. Oh my goodness. No! I can't believe it. So many close calls today, you guys. All right, I think we got, um, yeah, we got a loyalty mission for Tally already. Okay, well, I still want to do this last dossier uh, mission first, so let's do that. Let's go back to Ilium. We good? Fifteen away, I know. They said find someone named Dara, I think. I think Dara may be the assistant who is outside of um outside of Liara's office, maybe? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna take out Thane for sure. He's got throw warp and shredder ammo. Very cool. Okay, and then let's bring Kasumi. Okay. Exciting. 23 points. Okay. Hurls enemies through the air using a powerful biotic field. And then warp is a mass effect field damages enemy targets and stops health regen. Detonates any biotic powers already affecting the target, causing further damage. I think this is what Miranda has. there too. Throw would be nice. Hurl multiple targets. Or increase the blast radius when warp detonates biotic effects. You can get them both. Alright, we want throw fields. And I think we also want Unstable warp. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna stick with the new sniper rifle.
We'll give him that one too. And the locust. Okay. The only solution is daily streams. <laughs> It might get that way next week, Red Penguin, because I'm trying to beat uh, Mass Effect 2 before um, the Sunday after Dragon's Dogma 2 comes out. And I don't, I don't know. I feel like I'm moving through this game too slow to be done with it by then. I think we have like three streams left between now and then. Pardon me, I'm on a call. Daily 12 hour streams are converted. No way! If I could start streams earlier, I would. But I can't. Okay, I'm gonna check up here because I think this Asari might be Dara. Okay, well, she's not here. Liara is not here, of course. Dara. Basement? Maybe, um, Dara's the one in the basement? Transportation hub. Never mind. It's fun for the whole family. Come to the fish dog food factory. All right, transportation hub. I don't see that anywhere. Uh oh. All right. Let's do it. Transportation hub. I think that's the way to the bar. Right? Timber Ghost, thank you for the bit. Daily stream. <laughs> Daily 24 hour stream. Sure, why not? I spent the last two years here. I had a purpose, a goal. Now that I've accomplished it, something occurs to me. In all that time, I never looked at the horizon. It is spectacular. All right, I think I need to go th this way. I don't know. Red Penguin, thank you for the bit. Daily 24 hour streams, fun. <laughs> Only one bit away from BS5, right? No, Dimmer goes, no. Thank you for the bit, PS5 fun. There's no PS5 fun. I know the data is vital to the Corosa family. The son of Dantius didn't give us time to pack. This is where we found the other Asari. Oh no, I don't know where to go. I know this place is larger. Wait, who? Excuse me. You know where I can find Serena? She's not here anymore. Oh, you're the one she was helping out. Uh-oh. She took a job off world. Didn't say where. She gave me something for you. <gasps> Looks like a message. That's it, thanks. I'll listen to it later. Oh, sure. See ya. Can you tell me where Dara is? Oh, I guess later's now. Delete record. Oh, uh, delete, of course we're listening. Hey Shepard, I was on my way to a new life when the new burst arrived. The bitch is dead. <laughs> I assume that means your friend is alive and he finished his job. Tell him if I ever see him, I'll buy him a drink. Okay. <laughs> oh, up here, up here, maybe this way. <laughs> we need PS5 to play Ronin. Like the Dragon's Dogma 2. We consider is made of the made by the makers of Neo. So was um Lords of the Fallen, or not? Oh my God, not Lords of the Fallen. Uh, Wolong, and I really enjoyed Wolong. Who reads labels though? So I haven't played Neo though. The people too stupid to know their limits. You know 100 bits for no PS5 fun. Yeah, like <laughs> no. Yeah, thank you for the 100 bits. There's no PS5 fun. Thank you, Dan. Right. I'm sure she looks at some running gameplay and um, my lord graphics is not my priority, but it looks like a PS3 games. I told you guys when the trailer came what out i was like something that? looks wrong here I'm telling you relax Dax will never notice if y'all don't believe me no, for the crazy. not occult fund there's not a cult fund oh my god there's not a not a cult fund <laughs> timber goes thank you for the hundred bits i appreciate thank you i could call a cab but is that where i want to go 
Does anyone know where Dara is? I don't know. I don't know where she is. I don't know how to find her. Oh, I kind of do want to go I'm shopping, though. Oh, okay, bye. Dara? Hello? Oh, let's go shopping real quick. The store's over there. And don't get cute. Oh, wait, no, what is this? Expensive! Oh, I get a plus 30% health upgrade, though? Okay, wait, we need this. Yeah. Damage protection. Squad bonus plus 20% to shields, berries, and armor. Oh, that's really nice, too. I bought- I'm poor! Maybe a shirt. Or a car. 100 bits Billy. for shopping quick. Hey, your blue shifting already. <laughs> Chum, thank you for the bit for a copy of Guitar Hero 3, Legends of Rock on the Wii. And Dan, thank you for the 100 bits for shopping quick. No, I know fish. Alright. I don't know. I feel like I've been everywhere now. Where's Dara? Eclipse might be fun for you. For me, it's the future. No, PS5, only Snackos, she confirmed it. I do like Snackos, true. Wait, two negatives means there is no, no, no. You've been playing PS2 games, so game looking like PS3 games pretty good. It's not a cult; it's just a legitimate self improvement program. No, not that hey, either. We're friends, I have never called you that. No, but you're thinking about it. You think oh, Dara! Oh my God, I found Dara. She's the last I found Dara. dying breed. <gasps> Won't be many. Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or did she kill somebody already? <laughs> Oh no, the booth of the dads. She's hiding in this booth. I didn't even see it. Fish did. No, 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 no. The new fish are alive, okay? Don't worry about the fish. They're happy and they're thriving. Only want to talk, so what if she did? I have no idea. Just tell me where she is. If you insist, but fair warning, watch yourself around Samara. Justicars have a nasty habit of shooting people. She went to the commercial space that makes a few two hours of ago. us. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon. Okay, a cab. I do need a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Just a cars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in a sorry space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. I'm sure it's fine. Is Samara really that dangerous? If you follow the laws, you've got nothing to fear, and a just a car would die without hesitation to protect the innocent. But their code orders them to stop lawbreakers with lethal force in most cases, and everyone skirts the law somehow on Ilium. If someone tried to bribe her, she'd be obliged to gun them down as a matter of honor. I'm we all know the fish that. are dead. <laughs> They're not dead. Chum, thank you for the hundred bits. Why are you worried about other species coming in? Hi, oh. Carrie. I am the glob glob gab 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 I'm full of swibbly glibber cards. Oh, no. I am the yeast of thoughts and minds. You can't even figure out your own religion. Swabble dabble glibble glabble shrivel swap gee lab. Gibble dabble shrivel shrabble glibby glack swab. Swabble dabble glibble glabble shrivel swap dab. Dibble dabble shrivel shrabble glibby swap gee lab. I'm splendid. Gee lab. I think it's because you misspelled Hikari that time, Timber Ghost. Thank you for the hundred bits. I'm sorry about the scam. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just a cars. Tell me about the just a cars. They're a monastic order. They've given up their families and possessions to follow their code. Most of them are on some lifelong mission, but they'll always stop to deal with any injustice they encounter. Which I am the glob glow gab gallop. In some ways, they're the a lot like dabble, the specters gabble, undertaking blabble, personal blabble, blabble. missions. I'm full of swibbly glibber kind. Specters I am the yeast of the thoughts and minds. Who do just a cars represent? Swabble dabble blibble That's blabble shrivel like swap glab. I don't know a good human Dibble metaphor. dabble shrivel shrabble glitty glab swap. They represent their code, our code. Swabble dabble blibble glabble shrivel swap dab. It's group than a legal branch. Dibble dabble shrivel shrabble glitty swap lab. Nobody would question a just a cause orders. I'm splendid. Nobody becomes a just a cause for personal gain. <laughs> and they die before breaking their oaths. <laughs> Chum, thank you for the hundred yeah. bits. <laughs> no. I'm looking for Samara. Like I said, she's at the commercial space port. You can have the tab at the pedestal on that balcony over there. Zai sui chu w b b l e w o b b l g o b b l i f r i b b a b l a b o b e b l a b i m f l o b z i sui chu w y b b l y g r i b a k i n d o i m z a i s t o b s o t o s a n d m i n d o s s i chu w a b b l e w l g l i b b l e g l a b b l e 
イビービーエルイエスエイチダブリューエピージーエルエビーリブルダブルスエイチャイブビールスラブルグリブ。Terry goes, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you so much. Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, detective. You're not going anywhere, merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to look. <gasps> Scam last! Inject, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. Oh no, Lass, I'm so sorry. Thank you for the hundred bits. I'm sorry about the scam. Y'all breaking the TTS. <laughs> I'm a glob, glob, gab, gala, the swabble, dabble, wabble, gabble, flibble, blabble, blab. I'm full of shrubly glibber con. I'm a used to thoughts in mind. Swabble, dabble, glibble, blabble, stribble, swap, blab, dibble, dabble, stribble, strabble, glibby, glab, swap, swabble, dabble, glibble, glabble, swibble, swap, dab, dibble, dabble, stribble, strabble, glibby, swap, blab, I'm spin. The longer Eminem's TTS goes on, the angrier and angrier he gets. <laughs> Last, thank you so much for the 100 bits. I really appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Wait, I think I've heard this song. It is a song, apparently. Yeah, Chum introduced us to it the other day. <laughs> this is what Eminem sounds, raps sound like anyway. It's true. Yeah, it's true. He's very angry. Gets so good at the end. <laughs> Gotta be a way to play it again. You've seen other streamers do it. Yeah, there is a way through Streamlabs OBS, but I stream on just regular OBS. And there is like a like a extension that you can replay alerts on, and I tried to do it today, but it didn't work, so. Everything's just borked today, I guess. Yeah. Alright. We are here trying to find the just a car. Uh See, what does our journal say? Talk to locals? Ask around to see whether anyone has seen Samara. Wasn't Samara the name of that girl in the ring? What do you want? I've already got mercs wanting to kill me like they did my partner. I don't need any more trouble. As if that weren't enough, some Asari Justicar showed up this morning. All the natives are scared of her. I've got to get off of this world. Why is everyone nervous? Do you know where she is? Tell me how to find the Justicar. She's in the alley where my business partner was murdered. A detective sealed the area, so you'll have to talk with her if you want to go there. Why do you think it was mercenaries? It is! Dakni Kerr was cutting through a back alley last night when someone killed him with a shotgun. I saw his body this morning. They'd used modded rounds. That means Eclipse mercs. You must know something about these Eclipse. I occasionally do business with them. But only in well-lit places. With my guards. And only after the creds clear. This is a scummy bunch, even by merc standards. They sell red sand, all kinds of illegal items. And they are all cold-blooded killers. Why would these mercs kill him? And why do you think they're coming after you, too? I have no idea. We're innocent merchants. But they killed him, so they must be after me, too. I have to work the angles and get out of here. You don't seem too broken up about your partner's death. Dakni Kerr knew the risks when he took to spacing. Right now, my worry is me. It's unhealthy to be a Volus in the Nosastra spaceport right now. Especially a Volus named Pitney Four. Okay, bye. Go. Take care. <clears throat> Gotta be a way to play it again. Uh, it's okay, more bits for the PS5. <laughs> Thank you for all the bits, guys. Nothing works and everything's crumbling. Sometimes it feels that way. All right, we got to go to the blocked off section. Oh, humans. Oh, police. 
Who oh, wants us to go in there? I wanted to be a Justicar when I was young. Every Asari does, I guess. Hmm? Hurry and worker. Cops don't admit it, but the Eclipse sisters run this area. Think nothing to see here. Move along. You move along. I need a pass card for the elevator. Okay, I think we need to talk to the police. I don't trust that Bolas. There's something about him. You missed the train. Uh oh. Good thing no one except the Eclipse have mods. <laughs> All right, I'm here. Weapons locker. Nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. Well, we'll definitely, definitely be using them. I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. I need her help. I don't need your permission. I need to find Samara and get back to my mission, with or without your help. Sounds important. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. Then we'll get along just fine. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. Yep. She's at the crime scene. Why is she there? You want to get rid of her? What? What aren't you telling me? You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species incident. But her Justicar code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. I have no interest in dying, so if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. Don't follow that order. Samara sounds unprincipled. Give me directions. Samara would kill a cop? That doesn't sound very just. She would die defending an honest cop, but she'd fight an army of dirty cops to the death. I admire her dedication, but her presence is still a big problem. I need her gone before I have to carry out my orders. All right. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Funds. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. Oh, I'm ready. Lass, thank you for the 200 bits. Snacko funds. Thank you so much, Lass. Good I really luck. appreciate it. We better find tomorrow before that detective does. All right. Let's see. Are they going to let me through now? I wanted to be a Justicar when I was young. I still can't go in the elevator. Else, I oh, I got through. Eat it! Both of you! Area, let's consider this extra stock surplus. Ship the rest to Thax at his normal destination. He'll never miss a few lost pieces. Okay. Oh, oh! That was fast. Circuit boards. Get the rest of Bravo Squad fresh. Uh oh. Our squad went after that just a car twenty minutes ago, and they've gone dark. All right. Um. Let's see. Flashbang. Ready to roll. Ah! Oh, fire. So come on, choose. There really is a PS5 phone line. That had to hurt. Dan, no! <laughs> no PS5 fun. Dan, thank you for the 100 bits. There's really not a PS5 fun. <laughs> trying out everyone's new uh, new moves they're all really good like really strong okay yeeted Those there we go thank you for the bit ps5 fun there's no fun <laughs> You think I'd be Okay. Her? She would hurt me in ways you can't imagine. 
The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar! Oh no, she's hot! <laughs> What was the name of the ship she left on? Go to hell! Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. Wow! Ruthless! My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? You killed in cold blood. Friends? I'm Commander Shepard, and I need your help with a critical mission, Samara. You honor me, but I am in the middle of an investigation. Her eyes piercing. I need the best. I'm taking on the collectors. Mother <laughs> Booba. <laughs> Holy. Rival ruthlessness. No, we need her on our team, okay? For we're besties. Calls for a rule love. We love cold blood, it's true. I need you to help me take down the collectors. The Collectors are a worthy foe. I would relish testing myself against them, but I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse sisters smuggled her off world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes Well, cold. you killed the person who maybe could have told you. To go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. Uh-oh. You risk a great deal by following your orders, detective. Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. What just happened? Maybe I can help. Let's make a deal. Uh, the human is lost here. <laughs> when do you clarify? I was trying to convince her to leave with you, but just a car is in their code. The detective has been ordered to detain me. I can't force her to disobey an order. And after one day, Samara fights her way out of custody, killing anyone in her way. I am afraid so. Let's make a deal. I'll get the name of that ship. Do that, and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Oh boy. Garrus, move aside. <laughs> Her species are also mad Malian? I don't know. Can you tell me more about Justicars? We are individuals who have forsworn family, children, and worldly possessions aside from some weapons and armor. We travel Asari space righting wrongs as defined by the ancient code we have each memorized. We're stepping on the Asari's throat. Okay, why are you doing this to me? <laughs> Ilium may be dominated by Asari, but it isn't in Asari space. My quarry fled to this place. I am sworn to hunt her down, and I will follow anywhere she goes. It is rare for a Justicar to leave Asari space. But I must follow my oath. If I suffer for it, I will accept that. Do you have All right, we're just going to start. The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to us. <gasps> we just chatted with him. Preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well, I've got to get back to my station. And I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard. I'm on it. Human, no computing. <laughs> you. Hello again, Earth Clan. Did you speak to the detective? Start talking, or you lied. <laughs> you liar. Hi, Nova Kid. How are you doing? Good to see you. Hello, hello. We're having a wonderful day. Uh, hi, Tradaus. Tradal? Sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. Hello, maybe Maximus. I go with Maximus. Renegade player, yes, yes. <laughs> A lot of bad stuff has happened. Yeah, we let the council die. Well, excuse me, ask who this Samara is? She's a hot project. You said you didn't know anything about all this. You got one chance to change that statement. Try to change this. What do you mean, Earth Clan? Oh dear. Please put that away. <laughs> I'll be cooperative, I swear. Tell me everything. Better start talking. I smuggled a chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. 
I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse. So they are perturbed and want to kill me. You brought this on yourself, or I'll take care of the mercs. Tell me about this chemical you brought in. It's called Minogen X3, and it's very, very, um, illegal. Anyone with biotic powers who is exposed to it becomes more powerful. The higher your exposure, the more powerful you get. But too much of it, you die. That's the part that the Eclipse found disagreeable. You've been in the Eclipse base. What do you remember? It's oh, my legs! It's where the Eclipse keep their private ships. They're well armed and they've got mechs. And they're all murderers. Every one of them kills someone as part of their initiation. I need to get into the Merc base. You're gonna help me. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Ooh, we well, can take the I, elevator. I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> take it, but be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous. Yikes. Hi, Dragoonies. How are you doing? Good to see you. Who needs a council when we're a specter? Exactly. <laughs> Replace them with a human-only council. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not saying I enjoy all the renegade choices, okay? But we made this decision at the start of Mass Effect 1, and we are sticking to our guns, literally. Keep your eyes up then. <laughs> What do you think of these characters? Um, they're awesome. I love them. I love all of them except for Zaid, probably. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not looking disrespectfully. The council knows what they did. They know. <laughs> Activating. Oh boy. Oh, immediately. Okay. I see. Mind over matter. Wow, immediately yeeting things at us. Uh Toxic Woo Toxic. Oh, maxed out will kill you? What? Okay, this is actually crazy. I don't I don't know how to balance this just yet. Oh, don't max it out! Don't max it out! Oh god. One ball. Yeah, get out of there! <laughs> this is dangerous. You will not go down. Going dark. One ball. matter how are you finding the new sniper rifle it's growing on me for sure project is growing on me yeah ouch but i like booba who does not like booba weapons locker okay we're gonna keep our guns oh <gasps> scimitar assault shotgun new shoddy very nice 
Um, I don't want it though. I don't have it. Okay. Oh. Seems sus. Oh, we got a heckin' sneaker. Don't even think about it. Wait, stop! I didn't fire my weapon once. I pretended to because the other Eclipse sisters were watching, but I didn't really shoot. I'm not one of them. I'm new. I thought being Elnora the mercenary would be cool, but I didn't know what they were really like. Can we trust her? You chose your side, Elnora, and you lost. Screw that, bitch! <gasps> I knew it! You stinky son of a Tootsie Roll. She tried to pull a fast one on us. Can you trust no one? No trust nobody. This should come in handy. Gosh darn it. The B word. How dare she? Lying. <laughs> I felt bad when I first pulled the renegade trigger and then zero regrets. No regrets. She got angry. I trust me and no, don't even trust yourself. <laughs> I get to zero. Gosh darn it. She was all, oh, whoa, it's me. I didn't know what I was getting myself into. Oh, okay. What do we want here? Fire? See me. They're through my shield. Wow, throw is strong. Nice. Oh, shoot. Nice. I don't know if I'm ever gonna get over how much harder Tally's mission was than everyone else's. <laughs> Hers is real tough. I'll tear you apart. No, you. <laughs> yeah, this sniper rifle definitely growing on me. <laughs> Oh, more hacking? Cool. No regrets, shoot off. What did Titsy Rolls do? <laughs> Innocent victims. <clears throat> Gotta learn, Tali. Hi, Puskid. How are you doing? Good to see you. Happy Tuesday. Hope we're having a wonderful week. Oh, here we go. Here they come. Oh, good gracious. Okay. Those rockets, though? Nice. No, 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 no. <laughs> Why are they all moving in slow motion? Oh, there's still someone there. Oh, there's still two people there. Dude, these guys have a lot of health. They remind me of those um, silly droids in Star Wars that are like very weak and not very good at shooting. 
But these guys are like the opposite of that. They're strong and they're good at shooting. Mid station, eclipse terminal. Okay, okay. Stormtroopers? No, the other ones, the the skinny, lanky ones. Yeah, the ones that go Roger, Roger. I forget what they're called though. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no, let's not. What do we do to you? Uh, shadow strike? Oh, dang! I think we need to move in. Who's this? Well, there's someone back there. Kasumi, where'd you go? Oh shh. I don't know what's happening here. You're toast. I don't know what's happening. Where's the baddies? Oh no. Now you see me. Weakening their Oh shoot. Shooting. Oh, jeez. Okay. <clears throat> Have a good night, Timber Ghost. Get lots of good sleeps, friend. Thank you for hanging out. So good to see you. Uh oh, why'd that just break? Oh no. Their what? Oh, you're a bestie. I'm so sorry, bestie. What? <laughs> Who said that? That looks painful. Nice. Uh, no. Dang. Wow, I'm so strong. Uh oh, something stronger back here. You, with the rocket launcher. can tell where they want me to go. Maybe in that room? Yeah, I think we're going in this room. <clears throat> now you want to rewatch the prequels? Wait, prequels to what? Oh, the to Star Wars. B1 battle droids? That sounds right. Yeah, battle droids. They're so silly. Okay. A close exploding rounds. Blew the little bastard's suit wide open. <laughs> I can't wait to see some real action. Next time I go home, my friends are gonna be so jealous. I bet this is like um if you choose the paragon Hello, path. The killer. You were right. Yeah, I think if you pick the paragon path, you find this and you're like, oh, this. I regret not killing her. But we saw right through the facade. We knew. We smelt the lies from a mile away, okay? <laughs> no, just default choice. 
We've been spotted. Uh oh. Okay. Maybe you should not have broken that crate. Oh wow! Strong. Oh, they're still up. Okay. Let's go. <clears throat> Shepherd's good judgment. No. Um. Okay, maybe we should hide. Maybe I should hide. <laughs> I don't think I was hitting it at all. Oh my god! Okay. How do we get it? Fire? Run. Run! <laughs> We gotta be careful here. Oh my god, there's other baddies here too? Oh, we got the gunship though. Thank goodness. Jeez. That thing was crazy. Let's grab the ammo. Go this way. Hi, Corey. How are you doing? Good to see you. Ooh. Our bypass. Give me an easy one. Nice. This looks like a shipping manifest. Shows that Pitney 4 sold 2,000 units of Minogen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of Red Sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves the Volus is a criminal. I'm sure Detective Anaya would be interested in this. We'll see. Let's worry about that after we find the ship name. All right, I think I'm going to have to call it here. It is well past midnight. I think we're going to have to finish the rest of this.